Okay, are we live? Let's check. We're gonna start playing some other games as well on the stream, not just... It's like the internet's a bit shitty tonight. That's not good. Um, but yeah, so uh, I'm probably I'm gonna stop playing some other games uh, later on in the week. Not just Oxygen not included, I don't wanna burn myself out of this game. But tonight we are gonna play a little bit more. We are gonna play a little bit more. Got more water. I've already eaten, I do have to go change the dogs. Uh, a couple times um, until about eight o'clock, but from then I mean, they should be done with all their final rounds and everything. So yeah, I have to go change them out in like 30 minutes or so, and then every hour after that. So. Okay, what are we doing again? We're just building the power now, right? Like the electrolyzers and stuff. Let's do what we usually do when we start off again. Okay. So we do still have that. We have a printing point available, which we don't want to do right now. More salt water, yay. <laughs> we also said we want to do that, but we first want to finish this off. And we have to make them die. Okay, so again, we're going to take our time. We're not going to freak out. We've got 227,000 calories. Um, it's not really dropping too hard, so I'm happy with that. Our oxygen situation is completely okay. Yeah, I mean, geez, not since I was very, very young, so. Who is making that bark? <laughs> Sorry about that, the dogs are making noises and they get nervous when they bark. Um, yeah, but not since I was a kid, mate. I mean, geez, I mean, I played, I'd say I played Half-Life 2 more than I played Half-Life 1. I think I played Half-Life 1, I don't think I ever played it to completion, even. Um, Wait, let me just talk for a bit and see if they keep going. Um, but yeah, so I haven't, I, I haven't ever actually think I played Half-Life 1 to completion. Did play Half-Life 2 a lot though. Episode 1 and 2 and just Half-Life 2. Um, I had a mate that was a pss I forgot yeah, who it is. <laughs> just here, <friend>. um, <laughs> sorry about this. Uh, Beastie? Yeah, who are you? Yeah, as long as they, they look fine, they're wagging tails. So they probably just want to have some attention maybe go outside, but they need to wait their turn for 30 more minutes. Um, but yeah, so yeah, I've played Half-Life, Episode 1, Episode 2, Half-Life 2. I did play a little bit of Half-Life 1. I played a lot of Team Fortress 2. I've got Portal on my channel. Um, I'm busy getting through that in Portal 2. I've actually never played Portal 2 to completion either. So I'm excited to do that. But yeah, dude, Half-Life. Half-Life is a classic. It's a classic. My stepdad actually gave it to me. It's one of my first games. He gave me Doom. And after Doom, he gave me Half-Life 2. And then I was like, where's Half-Life 1? And he's like, I don't have Half-Life 1. <laughs> and I'm like, okay. <laughs> and I remember it took like fucking three or four discs to install the, all the fucking things. Which I was always worried that it would break <laughs> doing that. We just felt like it wasn't going to work. Stop tuning these things up. You don't need to tune these things up anymore. No one's running here. <laughs> Let's fix that in the beginning of the stream. Not halfway through. Um... Yeah, so again, we're just going to wait. <laughs> we just need to wait for this to get built. Once it's built, then we'll, and we can test it and see if everything's working. Then we'll actually, from there, I think, we're going to create our polluter tank, we said. Which we're going to dig all this stuff out. Then, once that's all done, then we're going to go and create our metal refinery. Once the metal refinery is done, we'll go and explore on this side, create our second power spine. Once that's done, we'll upgrade the base. We might need to upgrade the base a bit sooner. 
those who will see how priorities work out there. But, but I think it's fine, I think it's fine. How's our copper looking? It's the 21 tons. I'm not even getting to it, really. Is it disabled again? No. <laughs> I think there's just a bit much for them to do right now. That's why I said let them finish this. Let them get to their sweep commands that I gave them. Let's look at how neat and tidy we are. Very neat and tidy. Except for all the salt water. Zeus? about fuck yeah we must have to get to also do this at some point we might want to do that now actually I don't know if it's gonna fix it by taking this and connecting it to a transformer I don't think so because it's gonna fuck everything up we're just gonna leave it the way it is that's just emergency power. <laughs> it seems to always be going... But that automation that makes it that this is... Not really right, because... The moment these die, this will tell us to stop. Or to go. Like, I'm just trying to get them up. No, I wonder why doesn't work the way I want it to. So I don't see how connecting it to a transformer is going to change it. Come on, get full. <laughs> it's getting there. <laughs> I want to see what happens when it gets full. Oh, you're playing some little company, Joe. Yeah? Playing some little company, that's good. Probably recording another video. <laughs> but we're getting there. <laughs> hey, beastie. Okay, I mean, I don't know. I don't know, I'm gonna assume it's gonna be fine if it really isn't, we'll just disconnect it. So yeah, I guess this should all be removed and disconnected and connected to our main power spine. I guess that's the thing that needs to happen. I think this is what needs to happen, right? Because then all of that connects and then it gets the power out. I think so. And we can also get this wire back. Get this all in a poof. There's a lot of stuff there. It's not like we need that power right now. We can always use this. We can let this slowly drain until it gets connected to our main power system. But this, I think, is going to make it work. Because then it runs into the transformers. I think so. I think so. Okay, making progress, though. I hope. Hmm. Let's have a door here. The full system needs to be built. Looks like all of the power... plumbing... And the insulation has been done though. So that means we can start deconstructing these ladders. Oh, these ones we can just do this.
Okay, then we can put in the rest of our gas pumps. Nice, works out perfect. Good, good. And then we just need to sweep this areas up. Because, yuck. Yeah, they definitely can't get to that, but they can get to this. They could probably even sweep that, who knows. Oh, they actually stopped tuning this up. You're wasting microchips. Disable this building. <laughs> Disable all of these buildings. We will re enable them if we need them. But you guys are fucking wasting my precious refined metals. Don't do that shit. <laughs> Could tune up this thing if you want to tune something up. Thank you. Oh, so you have two more suits left? And then that's done, and then once this is pumping, we're gonna get that 50-50 split that I wanted, I'm pretty sure. How did I do this? Yeah, it's gonna come out, do a 50-50 split, and then give oxygen to our base. And we do the exact same thing here with the Atmos suits. That way we don't have to worry about the Atmos suits getting recharged, but our base will also get a lot of oxygen. In fact, we'll probably end up even getting some backlog. But remember, if that ends up happening, all we really need to do is use more power. We'll never get more dupes, sorry. Which we currently have space for two more, so why not? Once everything is set up. Because <laughs> then we must have 12 suits, works out perfect. Let's do it, let's get two more dupes. I'll start checking them out. If it's really good dupes, then I'll watch it. Tidying, farming, and decorating. At least. Tidying, dupes. So they both start with super hard digging, they both have allergies. The one has to use this. This guy's pretty good, right? Let's get Joe in here. It's probably a mistake, but let's get Joe. He's just gonna be sneezing a bunch, it's fine. Okay, Joe, you're on the schedule here. And the priorities for Joe. But let's get him decorating first, then we can farm, install, and tidy and shit. But he's gonna be our decorator. Joe, we love decorating. Mm -hmm. uh, your hands morale can still handle some things. So I guess let's get him. Let's get him this. Yeah, let's do that, let's do that. Make him a little faster, and then his exosuit thingy lasts a bit longer, nice. Okay, all that's missing here is these joint weapons, and then we're good. This is also being built slowly but surely, which is really nice. Can also finish off this ladder system now. Luckily they can get there, but yeah. It would just be nice. Okay, then what else? I think we're good. Again, I think we just need to wait. That water is slowly draining because we do have research still selected, I'm pretty sure. Ah, they're already done with it. Mm, what is this? Mechanical analyzer? Sure. Let's do that so long. <laughs> and a skill point. That's David. Now people still have not set this off. Okay, there we go. There we go. Ooh, people have slime lung as well. Yuck. Three people have slime lung. Yuck. This area needs to be cleaned, but we'll get there. We're going to probably end up putting some deodorizers like right here. Yeah, 
we'll see. We'll see where we put some deodorizers, but we are definitely going to clean this air up. In fact, let's start doing that now as well. Let's put deodorizer there, deodorizer there, deodorizer there. And then yeah, let's X to deconstruct. Yeah. And what's nice is, is we can just connect a lot of these up to our main power spine. Or use our conductor one. Okay, they're not going to do that right now. So let's do that. Okay, this can surely power this as well. Uh, that's already connected. Got a few more generators. And then this. I have one here for now. Eventually, we will obviously have transformers in here to do things, so not a bad play. We might end up just deconstructing that once we're done, but we'll see. Okay. So, our deodorizers can do some cleaning, you know. Still have a lot of polluted water here that we need to get rid of, unfortunately. But we are going to make a tank here and we're going to sort this biome out first. We're going to completely strip mine it out. Except for obviously the thingy. There's the heavy watt wiring. Deodorizer, nice. Just so that way these are going to stay in here just to make sure that they don't fucking... We don't have carbon... Oh, I didn't put a carbon skin in here. We should have put a carbon skin in here as well to get rid of the carbon, but it's fine, it'll just drain out into here. It's not the end of the world. And this should also probably, I don't know if we can do high pressure gas vents. Give me plastic, yeah, give me plastic. It's coming, okay, it's coming. Sure, we'll get a glossy Draco at any time now. <laughs> and that will get better, don't worry, we're all working on it. I just want to finish this fucking project and they're busy giving things tune-ups that I'd much prefer them not do right now. You're wasting my cobalt, bitch. <laughs> Who cares about this? This is not on a high priority. Can you guys build? Not seeing uh, okay. Okay, just go bold this please. Please just go bold this. Please just go bold this. <laughs> so once this is bold then we can do this because you guys are just tuning up everything constantly. Which is gonna be great when we actually have everything set up and everything's running. Can you guys build this shit? Stop it! Just stop it! Jax! <laughs> I'm just not gonna look. I'm just not gonna look. I'm just not gonna look. Looks like we are officially at a surplus. Oh, we're going to like a 100. We are officially at a surplus of critters. That means it's time to start getting some excess. Yay, cycle 100! Remember when that was a big deal. <laughs> These all have NGs tuned up. These all have NGs tuned up. <laughs> That's 20th century, yeah. yeah. 
Might have been a while since we checked on our achievements. <laughs> nothing new, nothing we haven't gotten before. Have we done that stuff yet? We have. Yeah, let's just keep doing that with the research. So that way we can also eat some of this water. So we can go get this tank. And once that tank's done, we'll pump this tank. And once this tank's done, then we need to find more water. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that is a whole thing we need to do again. And yeah, we're going to do what we did last time, but we pump our polluted water into our... I think we actually start pumping this all out. That'll be a nice and easy way to get it all out. Pump all this out into our metal refinery, let it drain out, let that pump into our polluted tank. And that's how we do... What are we missing? It's because it's just a copper. That's not good. <laughs> Not gonna change it, so deal with it. <laughs> oh, also, what the fuck? This is gonna be an issue, dude. These little two blocks here. That's gonna be an issue. We can always just do this. And build it out and let it flow. Okay. Our first power system is almost up and running. We just need some copper. Which they are probably getting. Nope, they're doing some cobalt. <laughs> oh, it's just 88 degrees. Oh, fucking word. It's 90 degrees here. Fuck me dead. That's hot. <laughs> Jacks, be careful, don't die. <laughs> That's fucking hot. <laughs> I sure, still at zero though, so I'm not too bothered. I think we can't get another dupe, but calories don't seem to be going up anymore. So we should first focus on getting more calories. And then we'll do that. Yeah. Then we'll get more dupes. Okay, missing a bunch of copper. That's all that's left. So, that's nice. Yo, with all this built that it doesn't need copper, let's carry on digging here, yeah, dude. Let's, uh, let's really empty out this place. Oh, it's holding right there, that's fine. She just has to move. Also, I want to put this one more down. I should stifle it nice and quick and make sure that pressure stays there. <laughs> okay. So dig all this out. Nice. Dig all of that shit out. Please and thank you. Yeah, and then once you've done all of that, we'll then set up insulated tiles, I think, over here. To make like the base of the tank. And we'll do the same over on the side, probably from that. Stick with the abyss light. That's the same height. One over, one over, damn. Okay, that's how high the tank will be able to fill water up. It'll even go through the steam vent and stuff, so you can even maybe help chill that, we'll see. But yeah, let them get to this. 
Just be careful getting stuck here, guys, please. This guy likes he's digging. Watch them build him in, yeah? I'm getting nervous about this. Someone's 100% going to get trapped and I'm going to miss it. Or they're going to let this thing completely out. That's fine. I know what that's about. We need the copper guys. <laughs> Which we again, we have 20 tons of copper ore. They just need to get to everything. One more suit left, which is also using a buck up at like a priority of nine. So yeah. Well, if they dig this out, I'm gonna be so mad. Just get a priority of nine on that so they can do that and get it out of the way. <laughs> Once all of this is dug out, then we're going to be a lot better off. Yeah, deodorizer here and a deodorizer here. And we'll probably end up having like a double mango airlock system here. And then that'll be into our big tank of, of kakanes. That we can use to also store things. <laughs> Let's get the fertilizer. How about with this stuff? Letting out too much stuff at least. Ooh, it's erupting. Be careful, guys. Don't let out too much steam pressure. <laughs> okay, at least they built that stuff. Okay, so this wall's pretty much done, and even if they break this, it shouldn't leak out, so. This they can break as long as they're careful to do these two first. <laughs> Just make sure they don't fucking get themselves trapped. I think that's going to be the easiest way. Right now, I don't think the water is going to pull up that much to the point that it's going to overflow. And if it does, like I said, we're going to pump it in, in any way to our metal refineries. It's not a big deal. Okay, you see this? This right here? Now needs to be a do it the fuck now thing because you guys are fucking idiots. You're you're seriously gonna trap yourself. What happened to him? Where did he go? <laughs> okay. I think he's fine. I think he's fine. Are you done with that? Nice. Okay. Okay, well, we're making progress with this at least. Still missing the copper. Still missing one suit. <laughs> Still doing cobalt, apparently. And copper. We're doing copper. It's just being used elsewhere, apparently. Oh, another, another one of these, really. We should definitely again, but once the power system set up, we we'll have a bit more power coming in. Then we can actually go do a little few more things here, like completing. I think yeah, let's complete the power. Let's do the Draco farm and hatch farms finished. Then we'll go and do the no, yes, no. Ah, oh, I don't know, dude. We should also really go and do the metal refinery as soon as possible. I like come in through here. I'm thinking, and in here, set it up. Get our breeze water as well from the woods up there. Um, set it up, get the metal refinery going. We're going to set up a whole extra thing. Uh, or we can just put a separate transformer here. We'll have to build a whole extra thing. But yeah, we'll, we'll see what happens. Because this is taking very long. 
At least while they're waiting for the copper, they have other stuff to do. We are busy doing our polluter tank, shielding this natural geyser off, so that's eventually going to be a thing. Just waiting now. Just waiting. Seems like we've been doing a lot of that this this in this colony, which I'm fine with. Like I said, I do want to take this slow. I don't want to rush things this time. Okay, in seven minutes I need to go change out the dogs, just FYI. But yeah, I'm thinking of us playing Resident Evil 2 on the channel. I'm thinking that's gonna be a, quite a fun one. Something that we could have a lot of fun with, so. We will see what we do with that. First, need to finish the DLC though and upload that to the channel. I mean, I first just need to finish editing the fucking stuff and uploading that, I guess. Because <laughs> I finished the game ages ago, I just haven't finished editing it. So, yeah. Hey, our deodorizer is going to town for a little bit now. We are eventually going to deconstruct this, obviously, but. I don't want to tap into this just yet. When we need more power, I'm going to start tapping into this by creating some natural geysers here and pumping that, that stuff in there. And then creating some automation and all of that stuff to try and make sure that this doesn't pump. I don't know. I'm going to see. I haven't really tamed natural geysers in a proper way before, where it's like efficient and everything. So we'll see how it goes. Can you stop giving the shit engines tuna? Please! <laughs> Please! Prioritize uh, this one more. <laughs> Can't I do that? I feel like do this one. <laughs> so give this a six so they can get through it. They're all gonna be scolding their shit, but it's fine. Because everyone's gonna be in there. <laughs> we have a lot more gold now, which is really nice. And we have iron uh, and cobalt. We've got just a lot of metal ores in this game right now. Which is very nice. We don't have the most igneous rock though. We haven't mined a lot of the planet yet, so we should be fine. Just seen a lot of sedimentary rock there. The igneous rock. How does that look again? There we go. To the caustic biomes. Okay. Well, we want iron as much as possible, so that'll be easy. What do these have? Sedimentary rock and just a bunch of mud and dirt. Okay, cool. That's not too bad. Okay, we are still getting to this, which is nice. Yeah, and these two deodorizers are running. So we're going to at least slowly clean out some of the uh, polluted oxygen at least. And obviously anything that comes through the air is getting absolutely wrecked with deodorizers. So we're not getting any polluted oxygen actually in our base as far as I'm concerned. There might be some off gassing because of some bottles here and there, and some dirt, that, or some slime and stuff that was sitting around. But that should be gone in a couple of cycles. Once we actually get the polluted tank sorted out, we'll have somewhere to damp, damp, dump our polluted water. And then we also need to do our salt water tank, which I don't know. Ooh, I think I found a nice place to do our salt water tank. Right here, we can drop this whole bio and make that our salt water tank. And then we can pump cooling from here for like actual cooling and then we can pump water yeah for cooling for the metal refinery so okay that should work out well yeah guys we've got a lot of sweeping to do i'm sorry <laughs> clearing out a biome happens to just do that but again, we're taking it slow. We want them to sweep everything. We've been doing so well with that so far. I mean, we've got so much. Like, all of our resources are centrally located now. We can just go pull from them if we need to go build something, which is very nice. Except for, say, our metal. we find resources here. Have we built that last suit yet? We still haven't. Does this have the copper in it, though, already? It does, so we shouldn't be needing more copper. No, we need to make two more suits. <laughs> so we're all going to take more copper. And it's 600 kilograms of copper, which is so much. But it needs to happen. It needs to happen. We need to get these Atmos suits built and get it out of the way. I say as we first need to build this in order to fill them, but whatever. 
Xenia once the Atmos suits are built, then we'll first go tackle this. Build our metal refinery, get that finished. Once our metal refinery is finished, do the Dracos and the hatches. Once that's done, we'll build our second power spine. Once that's done, add this gas geyser to the power spine and add this gas geyser to the power spine. And then we should be able to be to do quite a lot for a while then. But we will see. We will see how that goes. It's yeah, it's being a bit all over the place right now. Long way for the dupes to go now to pick up and sweep stuff though, which is rather unfortunate. But it needs to happen. I want all of our shit fucking in our infinite storage. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> It's very centralized. It's like in the middle of the colonies, so at the end of the day, it's going to be the, the equal amount to go in a lot of the places with 11% stress, probably because they have to go into these kinds of areas for a while. It's not that bad. It's only 70 degrees in there. It's only literally scalding hot. <laughs> I guess they can hop up here for now. I don't know why I did that, but cool. Okay. We are making progress with this. Like I say, I'm pretty much ready to break this tank in. In fact, we can even do this. You know, let's let them first sweep up some stuff while they haven't gotten to that. Let's leave them. Because <laughs> the moment it breaks in, there's going to be a lot of water, and then they have to go into the polluted water to sweep up stuff, which is going to suck for them. So. Also, I am quickly going to go, and I hope the stream's doing okay. Because <laughs> uh, the internet does look a bit all over the place. But I'm going to let them do their thing. Someone's suffocating, which should be fine. Actually, let's quickly save. Like we always do when we need to go so switch out the dogs and everything, in case someone dies while I'm not at the computer. Let's go switch out the dogs, and I'll clear the smoke while I'm at it. I'm pretty happy at Papa. Like an hour. Are we looking? Is anyone dead? Not seeing a dupes have died notification, so that's good. <laughs> and it looks like they just broke the water as well, that's nice to see. Yeah, I'm pretty open to smoke. I hope everything's fine. 
Hoping we got copper soon as well. <laughs> It's almost your turn, please. Okay. Let's get back into it. Still missing that copper. <laughs> this is almost done, though, which is very nice. Hmm. Don't want another one because our food is dropping right now, which is not the best. We are gonna deal with it, I just want them to finish this shit. <laughs> got our last atmos, well technically, yes, we got our last atmos suit. No more copper ore, it's gonna be used towards that. Can we please get the, or the copper, refined copper's gonna be used towards that. Can we please get that shit going? Zeus, what are you doing, dude? Okay. Let's have a bunch of let's sweep again. Let's not sweep stuff we shouldn't be sweeping. Zeus, Baba Vach. Is this dog wants attention? <laughs> Sleeping agents. I don't understand it. Is she not collecting? No. So why is she sleeping there? It's a way for you to get back, right? Yeah. And we still have a spare cot. about I have no idea but Jax was just sleeping here on the ladder in the middle of all the polluted dirt oh we have some copper Yay. almost there guys <laughs> we almost have proper oxygen generation and have some actual extra little bit of power to then use <laughs> You can always add an overflow hydrogen generator yeah, if we want to. Connect it to the main spine. Now you guys are suffocating, but the quicker you build this, the quicker you don't have to be suffocating anymore. Just saying. Just saying, guys. Insufficient resources of LG. That's not good. Oh, that's really not good, guys. 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 <laughs> guys! Uh, guys! <laughs> oh no, guys! 
uh, with some algae, with some algae, yeah. Uh, it's a nice little chunk here as well. <laughs> this is why we need to build that shit, dude. Oh my gosh. Let's get all of this at priority of seven. Yay, algae! <laughs> Go deliver the algae! <laughs> Before we all suffocate and die! We should probably get some airflow tiles in here. Oh, and this all needs to be insulated. Why is this not insulated? Heat's gonna come from here. It's gonna let heat pass through, unfortunately. It's fine, I'll keep them toasty, I'll keep them warm. <laughs> Okay, well there's a little bit of algae, I think, enough to hopefully last us a little while longer. Just go fucking smash some copper and get this shit here, bro. I wish I do. So I'm wondering why is this dog moaning so much? I don't know. I think he just wants to go outside. Just wait. <laughs> It's not working. We're gonna fix it now. And then this should fix the problem. And this needs to be oxygen. Wait a moment. Not connected right now. Okay, well, things are being built, so that's nice. Just need a little bit more copper to charge the smart battery, and then we'll be good. Don't know why it's not charging. I think it's taking so little, yeah. Dude, what the fuck, man? Go to this. Oxygen, please. Okay, and there we go. We finally have a system. <laughs> oh. It has taken forever. And I can already see some issues arising, so let's quickly fix those. And this is going to create a lot of carbon dioxide, which we should have put a carbon skin before. I'm a bit miffy that I didn't do that. We might get rid of the deodorizer and just put a carbon skin there. We'll see. We'll see. But for now, it should be fine. So you now the hydrogen should help charge these batteries. Get them to full a bit quicker every now and again. You know. Okay, and now we can also finally do this. As soon as it's already wet. Might as well. Goes up four, right? And there it goes. There goes all of that water.
It seems we've got like a we've got a thimble reed seed there, I don't know from where, but nice. There's a bunch of stuff in there. Okay, now oxygen can start being pumped throughout the base. Let's look at how that's going. Half my suits are getting filled, oxygen is coming through. More will start coming through once we've cleared out all the polluted oxygen. Which looks like it's happening pretty quickly. Yeah, there might be a little bit of a backflow that's going to start happening here, but let's hope that the steroidizer can clean that oxygen nice and quick and that can then float out. Okay, but we do have oxygen generation now. So hopefully this will start getting a bit better. <laughs> it's already a bit more breathable, yeah. I'm going to keep our deodorizers for now, we will eventually take them off, if I remember. <laughs> um, it's just, I, I just don't want to cut those off and then this has to back up or it doesn't work so well and then something happens. Already there is quite the backup on our hydrogen generators, which is really nice to see. Because that means yeah, all of that gets pumped. Until they're full, takes it a bit slower, but still pumps it pretty quickly. Nice. Nice. That's a good power consumption rate. That's a nice power consumption rate because it charges the batteries while still allowing some backflow. So with as much power as we're drawing right now, we probably even want to actually already build. But again, we're going to do that over here, a second power spine. And start connecting some things maybe on this side with the power spine there. And then after that, we want to build a second one of these because we want to have two of these oxygen machines per power spine. So that way we just know oxygen is sorted. It's going to help a lot with the power. We're going to connect our natural gas generators obviously into the power spine and all of that stuff. So, yeah, we're going to see how that goes. But with this set up, let's wait for them to finish building this off. I actually think we can start there. Yeah, let's do that. Let's start going into... Okay, wait, this problem. Up. Was it killing all those plug slugs? I'm sorry, I know. Oh, how dare I? But they're dying. <laughs> they're gonna eat all of that cobalt <laughs> and excrete our division gears, which isn't gonna go to our thingy, so there's no real point in that. So, y'all. <laughs> And again, I am gonna start. Um, we can also break this tank in at any point now. It doesn't matter if it overflows, it's gonna get used slowly. So I'm just bring that up there. And then once we've got our metal refinery up and running, I'm gonna do our second Draco farm. I'm adding incubators and third Draco farm. I'm gonna finish the Draco farming and finish the hatch farming essentially. So that way we don't have to worry about food for a little bit. Nice. Very shitty place, I know. Very shitty, but hey. First suit's almost full, guys. First suit's almost full. It's getting there. You just need to give it some time. It's a 50-50 split, okay? I'm trying. And I think a lot of that polluted oxygen should be out now of the system, yeah. So it's just going now. It's just going now. Well, it's nice to know that this is now finally done. <sighs> Let's dig up that wheeze wart, put that shit down here. We're gonna need, what? Five more wheeze warts. So let's hope we can find five more wheeze warts on this uh, colony before we have to go to another planet. We just have to ship it over. But we should be fine. I don't think I'm doing a plug to our colony this time. We'll do it next time. 
I don't want to do it right now. <laughs> the already doing all of this is like, okay, am I remembering everything correctly? Do I feel like I'm doing this well enough? We are busy creating more refined metals and are actually storing it for once and not just immediately using it. So That's also nice. We can use that to add some nice things down here. Which right now, adding that metal refinery is going to chunk away this power. So we should even think about maybe adding a natural gas generator thingy as soon as possible. It's also close to our polluted water supply, so it'll add to that tank, which is pretty big, and we can always make it bigger. So yeah. Okay, they're getting to things. Again, there's a lot for them to do, so I feel like I should leave them to do their things for a little bit again. The moment all of these suits are filled with fucking putting that checkpoint down. We do have five thimble reeds in here, not that I think these guys are going to be really getting much of that water. You never know, that backup does fill up nicely. Especially now that there's consistent power, it's not going to just sometimes spill through. So I really don't know if they're all going to be getting stuff. There comes a bunch though. I wonder how Sandy's doing, I hope our sand's okay. <laughs> there comes some carbon skimmer stuff as well. And all of that's going to the thimble reeds, which are going all the way to, A, the fourth one. And I think the fifth one. Nice. Oh no, not the fifth one, but hey! That's nice. Uh, what did I add? Oh, it's sand. Sand, we're fine. <laughs> This is an oceana planet, so I think sand would be good for a while. Oh, did you get lullaby? You sure did, buddy. You're not going to, though. But it's fine. Oh, you did what? Are you going to make it in time? You sure are? Nice. Benefits of having multiple ranches on the farm. Even if they're not dedicated to ranching, they can at least go and do the lullabying thing. So, yeah. Yeah, now I know. We're getting you wee sports. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shush. We're getting there. Yeah, they just have to do all of this now. They just have to do this. They just have to do this. Tasks are stacking up. Mm. I can't get our food. is technically going up a bit more. Maybe I should, um, what you call it, maybe I should get one more, one more do, one more do. Okay, this is the time to see how our stuff goes with the oxygen, if it's still going to keep us going. It looks like it is, so that's nice to know, don't forget once the suits are filled up, it's going to give us even more oxygen, so I think we're going to be fine. <laughs> we will get more algae as we dig through these places. Again, I am surprised that we used all of the algae, which is kind of nutty to me. Especially seeing as we digged up this in, like, a lot of this fucking biome. But hey, it is what it is. I'm sure there'll be more slime biomes and more algae to get. Yeah, there's already some more. You know, that's a big no-no, we don't want that. Yeah, we're also going to have to dig in this, which means we're going to have to think about where we want to store uranium. I'm thinking about just putting it here for now. The dupes don't come down here a lot, nor over here. So that radiation shouldn't really get to them much, and if they have to, it's not the end of the world. So I'm thinking about that. Oh, everyone has skill points. Nice. Did you hazmat dig in? Oh, you already got your launch all the way. Let's get you the improved carry. Uh, you are struggling, so no. <laughs> um, Anito, give him, give her, give him that. Oh, you like digging, dude. Give me more digging. Give Jax this. Just give him mechatronics engineering. Seeing as she likes it. Ah, uh, Joe. <laughs> yeah, Johan, I would love to get this and this, both of these. 
and even this. I'd love you honey to be that guy. <laughs> Push. Okay, let's give you some digging points. That is actually interested to have. Since he likes tidiness, let's give you some tidying. And building. Nice, looking good. And that's the only one that's not able to level up. Give me a second, I'm, again, I'm hearing noises. <coughs> this is that time of the house, so just a bit of a Zeus, hold it for a little longer, my man. A little longer. Next one. Only two suits have been filled. This is going to take forever. <laughs> it's fine though, it is what it is. They can catch up in their tasks while they're at it. And yeah, this we can finally put back down to a 5 because they've gotten quite a bit of refined materials. In fact, at this point, I think let's uh, start upgrading our, our actual thing. Because <laughs> damn, it sucks. <laughs> Using copper, that's why we have so much. It's what we were saving it for once for this. That's a nice amount done. Oof, we're running out. I repeat, we are running out. Hey, that's a lot done though, that's a lot done. Oh, oh so close. Do have a lot of cobalt as well. Let's use a little bit of that cobalt, shall we? To complete the line. Now that line has a nice, a nice upgrade on it. So we shouldn't be getting any overload damage whatsoever. So that's nice. Okay. Now we do have a second transformer here, but I do want to connect the other incubators that we're going to be using and any other future things like the sweepers and things like that, just so that the system doesn't ever, we don't have to ever worry about this system because its potential load is 4.3. So if everything's running at once, at forever, then even uh, with the co conductor wiring, it's going to be an issue. So yeah. But at least we got all of this done should be less actual issues now so shouldn't be seeing that yellow and red happening now but I do think 4300 watts as a potential load is a lot it's quite a lot so I don't think I want to be adding a lot more to this <laughs> which I mean we are using quite a lot of things two grills, the eight fridges and stuff the skimmer. it is a lot it is a lot. Again, the current load is only 280, so we could technically put quite a bit more on, I'd say. I think it's more when the incubators are running. That's when the issue is. So, that's why I say, if we need more stuff in here that needs power, we can always connect it in. That's why I want to connect the other incubators and stuff um, on their own line. Same with the order suits. This is at max gas pressure. Pipes block because we have an absolute overflow of hydrogen. 
So maybe we can afford to maybe put some more power stuff in. So let's get this shit done, guys. It's another build, I'll take it. <laughs> With quick signs. Oh, but it's a mouth breather, dude. Nah! <laughs> Because <laughs> you could just set them to build. That's all they do. And they'll level up quickly. And we can put them in a, in a thing where they work. So they're off. And they simply don't do it. They just breathe a bit more, right? It's just they just breathe a little bit more. They breathe two dupes worth, right? So it'd be like we're getting two dupes in. In terms of oxygen. Which is not the best. Um, yeah. I think we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. <laughs> this is gonna go so wrong. It's gonna be bad though. Amber likes working during the night time, so let's make her work during the night time. This has that, so let's get it from here. Okay, cool. You just got that. That's all you do. I don't care that you can, you can research, I don't want you researching. You just build, bitch. <laughs> all you do is build. Okay, hopefully with that now it'll go a bit better. We'll see what happens to our already not so great oxygen supply. This doesn't look the best, especially because this doesn't run all the time. We need to be consuming power. I think they might just be suffocating because of the lack of oxygen. Zeus! Sorry, he's uh, bugging the dog that has like hard conditions and stuff, and I don't want to bug him. I really don't. You're a big guy, my man. You can't do that. You can't just go. I feel like this is going bad, especially because we added the mouth breather. I feel like this is going really bad. Yeah, this is going pretty bad. Where's some more algae that we can get? Fuck, dude. Fuck. Yeah, it's good. Four up. And seven. So we can help our our oxygen situation with some algae. So yeah, as you can see, this is just not working. <laughs> uh oh, we're suffocating. Let's hope we can get some algae there, dude. That's all I can say at this point. that algae that'd be great would really help a long way you know not letting us die <laughs> mm. 
Two C point. This is so good. Hmm? Yeah. So, I'm trying to give me. Kenny A is down just banging on everything. He's such a big, big dog at home. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have some oxygen generation again. Yay. How long that's gonna last? I don't fucking know. <laughs> uh, let them dig all this up so we can get all the algae, all the stuff that needs to be got. Let's wrap it up. And let's go through here, yeah, get our metal refinery. That'll chunk this power and hopefully make it that it's constantly going. See, this is a priority right now for them to make sure that we have just a little bit more. Cause I'm pretty sure there is some algae in here, and yeah, just a little bit more algae, you know. So that way we don't die, because that was pretty close. Everything else was red, it was all red. <laughs> and we have some oxygen flowing here as well, again. So hopefully, that will be fine. I love how yeah, it's breathable, but our base is not. It's not being this would float up, but it's going rather slow at doing that. And how far are you guys? Three suits? Okay. Three out of twelve ain't that bad. Hearing weird noises. Don't know if it's in the game or in real life. <laughs> So much to do, actually, dude. So much to do. Oh! Even this isn't insulated. I completely forgot about that. Okay. Yeah, I know. I'm sure you guys must be close. The gold's done. Nope. <laughs> Still getting there. Still getting there. It looks like our grid's upgraded though. All except for this. That's nice. Oh, and some things, yeah. I know, but we did, yeah, we did put that down. Okay, let's get the rest of these finished. still needs to be built. So there's a few things, but most of the grid has been upgraded, so that's really nice. So when it gets to that 900,000 watt range, it's still going to be fine. We'll be okay. <laughs> okay, they're pretty much done doing a lot of this stuff, which makes me very happy. Now they can get to this, and eventually get to this. Which is actually put this under priority six. Just the building will be fine because they they can dig where they want to. I don't really care too much. Just just get the building done so we can give access to the diggers. So they can get to the digging. Giving the dupes too many tasks. We're falling behind. <laughs> uh. But hey, we got some algae. I don't think a lot. Where's that organic tab? Three tons of algae, so we'll see how long that lasts our poor little dupes. Probably not going to be very long. But hey, oxygen yeah is better, oxygen yeah is better, oxygen yeah is a little better. Yeah. Do we still have like an absolute backup? We do. <laughs> might be worth it to get that fourth generator after all but I also don't know if that's going to really be necessary because remember a lot of these have engines tuned up which is why I think they're running so well to charge everything so I think the moment we get that uh, refinery built it's going to get rid of that backlog we shouldn't have to worry then ok we're getting through stuff here yeah. they're still getting to sweep commands yeah unfortunately <laughs> And yeah, we finally have a polluted tank, so we can also do this now, seeing as that's going to be there forever, pretty much. Uh, let's go. Okay. 
manually put all of that polluted water that's busy off gas and away in our nice little tank which does have a single deodorizer trying to deal with a lot of this mess but luckily we have deodorizers scattered around kind of the place so oxygen should be looking a little better soon so we go to our materials over there are you guys playing so lacquer huh? you guys playing so lacquer Very nice, eh? Very nice. Don't forget your big shoes. Wear a pet bull shoes this time. So still a lot of polluted oxygen here, but a lot more oxygen here now as well. That's clean. These dogs are going crazy. What are they doing, dude? <laughs> well, also, not even four suits in to our 12, which is just. Uh, Sorry about that. Some weird noises happening outside. I think it's outside, outside, not at my house. So I think it should be fine. Man, that backup just sucks. We really need to get to this. <laughs> Which they will, the diggers will not have that much to dig left. And then this way, this way, this thing has already been stripped by then. It's done. It's dusted. Let's leave it then. Oh, these are all getting full as well. We might as well do this. Copy these settings over. I don't think we're going to have that much bleach stone, so we should be fine. Sure, we need those. Give us three that will never ranch. We're getting there, guys. Four suits are officially full. Fully filled, fully filled, no oxygen. We're getting there, okay? It's also taking long because this isn't operating all the time like it should be. <laughs> Operates a little bit and then it immediately backs up again. <laughs> you can also always put some buffer tanks in. Like over here. Yarish. Will be Yarish. I don't know. <laughs> I think that might be a good idea. Bra, 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 bra. Bra, you're gonna die. Please go here now. Fuck. <laughs> Chill out, bro. Yeah, Hannah's fine though. She's scolding, but she's fine. You know, we maybe have enough refined metals and we are gonna build it. Let's let's leave them alone for a little bit. We have a lot of cobalt, so we can always just end up using that. Leave this shit alone. Come here for some salt and lime. Other than that, leave this crap alone, let it get hot. You guys don't deserve to be going and doing that anymore. <laughs> Shame. Yeah, no, holy shit in there. Good thing we had the insulated tiles. Our uh, dudes are gonna die soon. 
Ooh, that was a cramped, which is fine because I that's a glossy egg as well. Because they're probably gonna die. <laughs> We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. It's not that much for the diggers to dig. So they're gonna start prioritizing digging here now, which is nice. Yo, 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 attack this bitch. Attack this bitch. Well, we already blocked it off, it's fine. He can have his little bit of cobalt. That's a lot of cobalt. That's a lot of cobalt. That's a lot of cobalt. I want him dead. <laughs> going to eat all of our cobalt and excrete all the hydrogen gases. <laughs> no! Whenever I see that missing research station thing, I'm like, oh yeah, I must not forget. Looks like we're also getting some more reed fiber finally. We do have that glossy dracolic egg. Which means we're going to start getting some plastic soon, which is really nice. Which we can use all of this hydrogen gas for soon. But I want to save it up there's a lot of it. Speaking of which, let's going to dig that as well. Isn't there? There's not a lot more hydrogen coming up from here, so that's probably going to be what we have to work with. So we'll end up... Can we dig these? I think these consume hydrogen, don't they? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Okay, no, we're fine. We're fine. If you take hydrogen, I'll be mad. Does it take hydrogen? It doesn't say what kind of gas pressure, it just says it needs a specific gas pressure. So, I'm assuming it's good. What time is it? Okay, 15 minutes, I need to switch out the doggos. Getting there, we're making progress, we're getting to that resort, there's another one over there. Okay, so seeing as we're in here, let's build our refinery. There's three, oh my gosh. Okay, let's build our refinery like yeah. A little bit bigger, which are. And then we're gonna make our tank. size, but you're going to make a tank and all of that stuff. And then we get a metal refinery going, which I'm very excited for. So we're going to put the transformer here next to the refinery. I think that's going to be... Oh no, let's put it here. And then, I don't know. It'll be easier to bring the spine in and down. I think so. I don't think that'll be too bad. We're not going to be using stuff here. This is just going to be our entrance to our... Thing. We'll see. We'll see what happens. If you see it, get in. <laughs> if you can get to it, get it. Get it out of here. Polluted dirt storage is unavailable. It's fine. Because now you've got storage. Okay, cool. Now we can sweep everything up. Everything's looking a lot better. This is all also needs to be done. So I really do think we need to leave them once the refinery is built. But I actually just want to get the wheeze warts and the refinery built so I can start chunking some power out of here. Because this is an issue. I think we should build those buffer tanks. You know? I think that is something we should do. Even if it's just two, I'm fine with that. Okay. Okay. He's gonna leave this one tile caca messes, but it's fine. Oops. Yeah, anyway, we need to check out our flow now. So now it must. First, do a 50 I don't, I don't really care too much about how it goes in and out. But that. And then 
what you're doing. Yeah, I think that's good to make sure that it goes out that way and it doesn't come back in. Cool. Did you kill that fucking slug? Nice. Nice. Get rid of it. Don't want it eating our corporate. There's another one. Just, you know what? Yeah? You know what? Yeah? You know what? 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 Fucking die. <laughs> okay, well, we're getting there. People are doing their digging that they need to do and all that stuff. I think four dupes of slime lung, which is pretty fucking not good. Mm. That just so you can fertilize if you need to. Oh, I shouldn't have given that to him. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Wasn't paying attention there. See, it's slowly decreasing. What did I want to put in here? I forget what I wanted to put in there because the dupes don't go there a lot. I don't need it anymore. Yeah. Yeah. For once we've done setting this up to go and do the rest of our branches. And once the branches are done, then we can finally actually go and set up our next power spine, which is what I actually wanted to do immediately after this was done, but it's fine. And once the next power spine is done, oxygen should be good, our power spine should be good, then we'll set up the gas thingies as well, then we should be good on power for ages, and then we'll just fucking run like crazy with that. Also, let's get a priority of uh, eight. This, one of that. This can also be an eight. That can be an eight. This can be a five. This is a five, so yeah. Yeah. Cool. Go and dig that. Dig all of this, actually. Okay, there we go. There is some hydrogen here. Maybe I should be putting some air flow tiles in at the top. Yeah. Okay. Just to let that hydrogen flow in. And I guess we can put some... Yeah, there we I think that'd be good. We can't let air flow tile be here because it will leak out the air that we're trying to use. <laughs> Yeah, so hopefully with this buffer tank system we can store a little bit more gas. I don't know. I don't know what I'm thinking. I'm thinking it's a temporary solution until we set this up. That's what I'm thinking. The diggers are now busy digging here instead of here. So we can set this up. Which is a bit of a mess, but it's fine. We also have got more hatchlings to remove. We now have three spare hatches to kill if we need food. Which we seem to still be doing fine on. Our Dracos are not looking good, I think. I think they're probably starving. Yep. Seven cycles until death. Eight cycles, actually, until death. Choose what you want to do, boys, but we need to get to there now, actually. Okay, I'm gonna go switch out the dogs now. Um, because they are making some weird noises. Let's put it on Jenny. Okay, I'll be right back. Let's hope no one dies. Let's quickly save. Okay, someone does die. Okay, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go sort out the doggies.
dogs have been switched. Any death alerts? No? Okay, cool. I'm going to quickly go and well, let's go check maybe the Wii Sports. Have we gotten? Now we're getting there. We've got four Wii Sports here, dude. That's really nice. So there's our little tank. We are going to let it overflow so that it can cool this area off and we'll pump it. We'll do what we did kind of last game. And let's also get this done. So I want that weasel wart. Nice. Okay, so there, that's a lot set up now. They can go and focus on this. It'll be really nice. See, this is already this is storing hydrogen. It's already storing hydrogen. That's weird. So once it's done overflowing in there, it comes through, yeah. Which is super weird. That's definitely not how it's supposed to work. But at the end of the day, it's storing stuff. I think if it more comes in, then it's fine. But this is keeping the flow going. It's very weird what's happening. I don't know what's happening, but I'm fine with it. <laughs> as long as stuff works. So remember, it's first going to... this is back down. So it will take from the reserve tanks. Yeah, and it is pumping in, so more is busy getting joined in. And then it slowly fills up the tanks. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, I like that. And then when it needs the power, it's going to take from it. Let's go check it out. Hey! Okay, no! Come, please, please, come, come. Come, come, come. Always try and give them a chance to not go into the cages, but they always end up just growling and causing cock with the other dogs. So yeah. Okay, so now they take the hydrogen, if this could load, and then it starts depleting the tanks, I'm pretty sure. Not really, this is a really nice system. I like this a lot. I like this a lot, a lot. Buffer tanks. <laughs> This is still all under the priority of eight. They need to get to that. This is built now. You don't have to worry about this. System built. So now we should have continuous oxygen flow without it ever stopping, which is very nice. Very, very nice. Which means those suits are going to get filled up a lot quicker now. Our oxygen's probably, yep, a lot better. <laughs> I think we can finally deconstruct one of these. Okay, it's looking good. Let them get into here. Let them build these the rest of these things. We'll set up the metal refinery because it's not as much of an issue now. Oxygen's fine again. All of that's good. Food seems to be fine. So I'm not too stressed. We can now go a bit slower again. We don't have to rush. Let's take our time. Yeah, that's me. <coughs> yeah, your level stack, please. Look, Bella is also on beat, like the dogs. Beastie usually isn't the best with others. But Bella is on heat now, which is causing him to act not that nice and all of that stuff because Bella and Beastie are very close. It's the Scottish Terry and the Bushman. So, yeah, but now they have to get their cages. I was told that that was probably going to have to be the case. But still, I'm going to try. I don't like putting them in the cage. But they are cage trained and it's very comfy here. Yeah? We're a bunch of blankies. 
you need. Yeah, and Zeus is outside right now, so that way we don't have to worry about him and Shadow playing so much. Which I'm very happy for Shadow is a bit depressed since the, the girls have been gone. So it's nice that he's playing now. This is the he goes get back. Yeah, while I'm outside, I'm just going to just going to check outside in general, make sure it's all good and safe, everything's fine. I think we should be okay. We found snow and ice and stuff, we must remember... Wait, there's stuff that's liquefiable. That was checked. Where was that? Oh, yeah. Not here. Oh, yeah, we undicked it. Well, let's do... These, not that. And let's do ice and snow for this last one and the last three, I think. Um, and then we'll do polluted ice and polluted snow over here. Okay, cool. So we definitely want that ice to be in there so it can melt for us and give us more. Okay, they're making it the way that okay the Weezwort has been taken down, baby. Weezwort has been taken down, plant it. <laughs> Get it in there! We need to cool those warts down. The mill woods, we need to cool it cool them down. One more dog has to do their final round. Okay, no dupes are dead. That makes me happy. <laughs> okay, let's check. There's some omelets. Calories are literally maintaining, so that's perfect. This system still seems to be working, which is nice. I don't know what we accidentally did there, but that's cool. Okay. Ice and snow. Oh, more of these over 
here. Let's build him nice and big. Fuck off. Let's build him nice and close. Bottom ones will be for polluted uh, dirt and stuff, and the top ones will be for polluted ice. But yeah, now they're storing all that ice. We've got seven tons of ice in here. That's at minus 36 degrees Celsius. The slime lung gems are dying. There's just so many. These are not. But that's because it's the slime that's holding the slime lung gems. But the other slime lung gems are dying except for what's on the slime, which is very nice. Very, very nice. Okay, with this all finally, yeah, let's, uh, let's start doing things, you know. Um, it's in refinement, I'm pretty sure. Yes. Uh, let's build it as deep in as we can, I think. Okay? Like over here. Would be best. Which sucks, because, yeah. Okay, well, let's work on what we want to do. I think we do want to bring the main power spine in here. Let's do that. Let's not forget that we want to keep going down with it as well. Just so that way this is feeding directly off of it. It'll be somewhere around there. We'll, we'll add the one. Hey Anna, how you doing? How is everything? How is your evening? How are you doing? Okay, we get the metal refinery set up once we get that one. Is that board CP part? Yes! And already, everything is way better. <laughs> Our Dracos are no longer dying. <laughs> good. 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 Some of them are still starving, but they should be fine. We should definitely set up an incubator as well here. Just to get rid of the excess. Even if it's not powered right now. I'm gonna make a glossy Dracos. <laughs> and yeah, we're gonna have a glossy Draco farm and then another normal Draco farm. With four Wheeze Wards. I think there's still three down here. Yeah, we can build one more extra farm without worrying too much about the temperatures and stuff. But then the moment we build our third farm, it's gonna be a rush again to find some more Wheeze Wards. <laughs> Or maybe hopefully, well now that we actually have got some... Hmm. Do I rather maybe want to use these three Wheeze Wards for our radiation generation? I think let's rather do that. I think let's rather do that. Let's build like a Wheeze Ward farm here that just lets us do some radiation research. Hey Jams, how you doing my man? How's the night? How is everything? Well, it's not here by me. How's, how's the day? I don't know. I think it should be night time by you at this time. At least close. Those tanks full. One buffer tank down. As much as I would like to, seeing as the cooling is fine and we technically have one farm, we'll set up the framework for the other two other ones and then the final thingy. But for now, I think let's just have the one Wii Sword in there and let's get the other three for the radiation generation. I think that'd be really, really good. You can start setting that up here. Okay, we're looking good though. We are looking good. How long have we been going for? Almost two hours. And we finally have all of our systems here set up. Our suits are also almost filled, so then they can start doing this on a bit more of a chilled level, so they don't have to go in here and do all these things. Why is it just a random Draco they accumulate? Um, so they can go and do all of this without getting hypothermia and slime lung and all kinds of shit. With our buffer tanks going, it seems to be working well. This should hopefully hold off until until we get the metal refinery going, then there shouldn't be a backlog at all. Then the backlog should be gone. 
Jack, we first need to do all the other stuff that we told them to do. Which is a lot of sweeping errands. <laughs> a lot of sweeping errands. Speaking of which... <laughs> that's that polluted ice. Yeah, I know we're getting there, guys. Oh, yes, we can do it. Now they have a place to even store the flutes. Nice. Not seeing a lot of red things. Sleet wheat grain. Is there anything in here that we have unticked? That needs to be ticked. Okay, we don't want any liquefiables in there. Shut down. Lick my foot. We could put our mud in here. That's not going to off gas. That's not ticked here, right? No, it's not. Okay. Now yeah, that seems up to screw up. Yeah, well that looks good. Only three and a half more suits to go, and then we can finally start using those Atmos suits. Uh, the slime light is pretty much everywhere. There's not too much we can do about it. What the fuck bug is that? What is that? What is it doing? Oh, it's quite far away. I'll kill you, dude. If you fly towards me, you're dead. Yo, yeah, stay behind that picture. Get stuck there. Stay behind that picture. It'll be good. Some weird ass bug. It's got really long antennas. And oh, look, it's out of the picture. Oh. <laughs> I might quickly need to go kill this thing. You guys know how I am with bugs. Near four. Near four. Yes, no. I'm going to go kill this thing. Did you eat it, Chad? You fucking Chad. Let's kill it. Get, 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 get away. He's a good shadow girl. You ate the buggy. Almost. You let it get away. But you, you tried to eat the bug. Good girl. That's why you have dogs. <laughs> okay. They're taking their time to get to this now, I will say, though. Soon, guys. Soon. Promise. <laughs> okay. Oh, and this is also finally done. Can okay, now get rid of all of our polluted water that's sitting around. That's nice. Okay, cool. We're making progress. Now is a really good time, though, to just let the dupes catch up on tasks. We're letting our atmosphere suits fill up. We're almost there, three suits away. Once the third suit's done, we're going to put that checkpoint in. And hopefully we have enough oxygen generation, because it is a 50-50 split, let's not forget, to make sure that those stay full. What's also nice is once they are full, there's going to be more oxygen in the base. Which, yeah, I think would be needed, getting rid of one of those oxygen that... Well, you know what, none of these are providing anything. So why don't you guys go fuck yourselves? <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> sure, we'll be fine. I'm sure this isn't a horrible mistake. I'm sure we'll be okay. We can always add one back here if we need to, and one here. Shadow. Sure, Can't wait till it gets to like 10, 11 o'clock and all the dogs are passed out. No offense, I love them to bets, but when I'm streaming it, fuck, it gets to me so much. I'm, I get so nervous. Like, oh my gosh, are they okay? Is everything fine? Oh. Okay, so they're deciding to go do some stuff there, they're deciding to go do some stuff here, which is nice. Again, come on out, my suits. <laughs> you got this. It's only three suits left. I'm getting so impatient with them. I just want to connect the, the thing already. Yeah, food's pretty much like it is going down, but not really, so 
I'm very happy with the amount of dupes we have. I think it's a perfect amount if we can just keep the, uh, what you call it, the, uh, the oxygen going. Because right now it is, we need that to flow up as much as possible. And that is already flowing up as much as possible, so that's going to be responsible for future base oxygen. Initiative. I am happy with our system though. So far this base is working quite nice. I'm very happy with this. Just the second buffer tank is almost full already. For real. Come on guys, we need, we need to get in there. <laughs> We need to go do that shit, like, now. Yeah, I gave a sweep command to priority 6, but it's fine. Go sweep the stuff, it's okay. I don't care about this. Do this. Do this, yeah. So I can build the refinery so we can start charging through some of that hydrogen, because two, two buffer tanks was not enough. Because the moment this one fills up, then it's going to start backing up. Yeah. Yeah, and then our oxygen is going to become an issue again. Yay! We have what seats stored. Yeah, right. So it will come here yeah, eventually. Yeah, it won't just be left in. So like it'll die. <laughs> I'm just so nervous about it because I want to plant those wart seeds as soon as possible for the radiation research, so we can get our steam turbines going as soon as possible. So if we can do that, we can start creating some cooling. Which the first cooling thing I'm putting is right here, putting an aqua tuna right here. And I'm letting it do a nice long cooling loop on two floors, like this, um, with some salt water. And then I'll put a second aqua tuna here, doing the exact same thing, connecting the steam turbines to our thingy. And then once this power spine is set up, I'm going to set up a third aqua tuna over here-ish, to, to make sure that our water stays cold. Um, that'll be solely for the water. And then that will also connect our main spinal with the natural gas geysers and everything. So I have got plans. It's just we need to get certain things, basic things, done first. Like this. Again, I am happy though, because I'm pretty sure we've got a nice amount of ice. Didn't go up much, and I didn't go up at all. But still, 7.6 tons is a lot of ice. That's going to be a lot of ice. And we've got a lot of polluted dirt for the salad. Oh, sorry, mud is what I'm looking for the salad spinner. Pluto dirt, I think, can feed to some critters. But other than that, we're probably not going to be using it that much. And this has our bleach stone, obviously. Almost none of it, because we haven't been digging into a lot of this place. These caustic environments, I think we dug through one. That was over here, and that was just the entrance of it, really. So, yeah. A lot more hydrogen here now. Can definitely start pumping this once we're done with all these things to our Draco starving station thing. Uh, we're going to take the glossy dragon legs, thank you. Which will change to dragon eggs once we get the farm going right. Maybe I should make this a glossy dragon farm already. So, ah, nah. We'll, we'll get plastic when we get plastic. We can always build the things so long, it'll still take a while before they can't eat. Yeah, we just need to, we just need to fucking get this metal refinery going, indeed. So once that's done, they can start finishing up, and then they also just need to finish up all their tasks. There's so many things to sweep now and to do. Just do this, get it out of the way. This is going to be where our, uh, um, next research tier is going to be. We'll start building more power stuff, I think, over here and over here to connect to the power spine because of how this entrance worked out and everything. They're getting there. They're getting there. We're at 32% stress, dude. Those Atmo suits could just get filled. <laughs> Only two left. 
because water is also slowly dropping. It's not that bad. Oh yeah, I researched. Let's keep that going. Uh, yeah, we're gonna keep these all up. I know we're not unlocking them, but I just want to get all the blue and purple research done for all of the stuff. So that way it's out of the way. We don't have to worry about it. And then Technically, we could deconstruct this, and white clay would obviously need us to put it in, but we could always just rebuild it. Then we could deconstruct these, uh, I think not this one, because this is what we require as a laboratory to be used. Um, what does a laboratory require? Two science buildings. So technically speaking, as we get science buildings, we can just replace them, which we already have a lot of. We can put the virtual planetarium in here. No, we can't. I, I'm a liar. <laughs> Uh, so we'll probably end up just leaving it there for future use. Damn, I was really hoping we could fit that in. That's kind of lame. Yeah, well, we can always just make another laboratory. We can always put it in over here with this thing. Okay, they finally got into it. Well done, guys. Only oh, took you guys ages. Okay, everyone. And then for the shitstorm that is going to be this, and getting our piping sorted for this. Okay, so we actually want it to kind of overflow, right? So let's put the pipe yeah, So that way it can overflow still. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Because a fucking idiot, you dumb shits. Let's hope they get saved in time. Jax is still so injured. We should probably get a triage card. I think that he'll be fine once we build that second ladder. Yeah, there we go. Uh, we should really build a triage card now that I'm thinking about it. There's a nice space for some triage cards. Hey, where's like some useless space in there? Yes, like some useless space. Just two triage cards so that if someone is injured, they can get some heals. <laughs> uh, but yes, we were busy with our plumbing before we got really interrupted. We can also actually just deconstruct this now. I'm not worried. Uh, plumbing. Yes, we did that. Can I have the overlay, please? Okay, now we need to get the input. Why can't I zoom out? Zoom out and do this. That's so fucking weird. Pretty sure I could always do that. Okay, we're not going to be taking from that. We're going to be taking from here. Actually. All the way at the lowest point. Go, 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 no. I think it's going to be like here -ish. Oh, no, it's up. Oops. Um, boom, and then now we need power. Actually, gonna have doors and stuff. Yeah. For now, let's just do it the way we shouldn't do it. <laughs> Maybe we should, because we probably want to put deodorizers and stuff here yeah, and things. Mm. Okay, let's do it properly. Let's get the tiles in. That'll be our entrance. Be our transformer. 
Okay, cool. Then we're gonna go power. Uh, so actually, we don't want this. So we're going to do that, and then our other door will probably be around by here. Yeah. We're only going to put one in here because there shouldn't be a need to put more than one transform in. Yeah, let's not be lazy, let's do this wrong. <laughs> let's switch over maybe to some. Oh, that was iron? No, I thought we've been using copper this whole time, we've been using iron. No. Not our valuable iron. <laughs> I know we have this, but we are getting rid of that eventually and closing this off, so it's just good to do this. Yeah, let's do this. Okay, cool. Making some progress. Making some progress. There you go, we're going to use all this blue water as some coolant over here. It's going to drop in, do all that good stuff. So I can we oh we can't. Probably should have realized that that was you know what it is. Um okay, so. where is that going, dude? What are you trying to connect to there, bud? <laughs> okay. This also is so far away from our main colony, I doubt the heat's gonna be an issue for a long time. Alright, we actually set up as much heat required things here as possible. Let's also maybe get our kiln in as well for our later stuffies as well. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'd even be tempted to move the rock crusher, yeah. But we're not gonna we are gonna use it for lime. <laughs> Let's not do that right now. For now, let's just leave it at that. Let's just leave it at that. Just making sure the dogs are okay. Okay, getting there. Yeah, once they build this, then we will get started with our rad board generation as well. I guess we could start building that as well. Yeah, as soon as it shoots that way, then you'd be smart about the thing in order to research that to come through. Ah, I can't just flip this fucking thing. Um, we're not going to have a lot of rad board generators because they take so much power. One day we will. Always what there, always what there, and always what there. So three. And they're all gonna shoot where they need to shoot. So we're gonna have two red red bolt reflectors. One over here. And there's not enough space unless I do this. There to shoot into the air. Nice. Weasel tile. Weasel tile. Weasel tile. Let's do that. Wait, but actually, no, wait, actually, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, cancel. Because that's going to be down over here. And then there, there. So this one needs to be a bit closer. I am wrong. Okay, so let's say the weasel tiles are going to be here. So one's gonna grow there, it's gonna grow over how high? Two tiles high, right? So there, and one's gonna be going there, two tiles high. So there, and here. Two tiles, two tiles. 
Plus 2000. Put a farming tile. Can't put a farming tile because the heavy wiring is there. Also, I'm doing this all on the wrong floor, I just realized. <laughs> Fucking idiot, dude. Oh my gosh, okay, let's try this again. Over here. <laughs> let's first do the farm tiles this time, to make it easier. Okay, so we're gonna put one here, one there, and one there. And then with that, we can do our right bolt generators, right? So we're gonna do tiles high. Nice. And then the rap bolt effect is still, yes. Well, now they're all shooting over here. So we can just do that. Nice. Way better. Way nicer. And we do have some Wii Sports. So, it's good to know. Again, more, just more shit for them to do. But at least, once that's done, we can start researching. Like, we can actually start getting some steam turbines going. We can start getting some cooling going throughout the whole base. I'm actually very keen. Very excited for that. Also need to keep an eye out on the time. Got 30 more minutes and I need to switch out the doggos. Also, it's finally happened. It's taken so fucking long, but it's finally done. We can get this out of here. Now. <laughs> now. <laughs> um, but nice. So that also probably means that this is now running way better. Which also probably means oxygen is still just kind of doing okay. Let's add a third, shall we? Right there. Just to help with that. Because that doesn't seem right. Because I thought the oxygen would be flowing up, but I guess we're consuming it too quickly. And that it's not getting a good chance. So let's just add a third one in here, you know? Just to get this in it right here now. Did you build it? Did you guys build it? You guys built it! Yes! Atmos suits are in play! Yay! Okay, so that means from now on, anything done in here is not gonna be slime lungy, it's not gonna be hypothermia -y. It's gonna be good times. Atmos suits are finally in, and we have 12 of those bad boys. So 12 dupes can still run in there and do things. It shouldn't slow down any of our times, seeing as we already have, or only have 12, du 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 12 dupes right now, so that's quite nice. So now whenever they go in there, it's going to be good times. They're not going to have to struggle. <laughs> Where is the polluted ice? Already storing none of it. I thought that was filled. I was wrong. But nice. That's good to know. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Mede Captain is, is what I'm about to say, because this is an issue. This is a pretty big issue. How much is it storing? 150 kgs. And this shit ain't gonna turn on for a while. Shit, dude. We need some power consumers. So as our oxygen's gonna die. Yeah, right now it's getting backed up, and there goes the stop of oxygen. So our buffer tanks are full! <laughs> okay, it's fine. We're going to get the priority suit straight so they can actually do this stuff. We get this all get done to better. Luckily, the heavy wet wiring is really in place for most of it. Fortunately, not for this, though. Okay, looking better. Let's hope they do some of these things now a bit quicker. But unfortunately, we need the oxygen right now, like bad. <laughs> and the atmosphere are also not going to get charged now. There's literally 
No oxygen generation happening right now, guys. Come the fuck on! Uh, you know what? 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 so nicely now it's just not use power guys use more power this is an issue this is a really big issue this is like one of those issues that could kill us for right now okay it's still okay it's still fine it's taking really long to build this shit though which is making me really nervous Okay, we have a little bit more oxygen coming in. Which half of it's gonna go to the suits, but it's fine. Come on, chow more, chow more. <laughs> Don't have engines tune up right now, please. <laughs> oh, I see someone giving it to them. Okay, there's a little bit of oxygen, yay. <laughs> And I don't like doing this. This was bad. So now I have to reset this. Let's make this 600. This oh, sorry. This is speed. 16. That one to go red. So waiting. <laughs> Oxygen's an issue, it's bad, I know how, how bad is it. It's so bad. Oh, it's so bad. We we may need to just quickly do this. Do we even have algae though? We don't. What else can we like make take power right now? I don't know. Come on, fuckers! Do this shit quicker! Priority now! Do it now! Please! We're gonna die! And I don't wanna die! Oh yeah, come on, come on, we got this. We have got this. Priority over 5, priority over 7. We're gonna do this at a 99. This at a 99. This at a 99. This at a 99. <laughs> this at a 99. I don't care how much we have of it, just do it. Um, I mean, this all needs to be a priority 9 as well. Please get this stuff built, guys. We are actually gonna die if you guys don't do this really quickly. So please try and get it done. Here comes a little bit more oxygen soon. Come on, builders. Do your jobs. Build these things. <laughs> Seems to be a priority now. Thirty-nine. Let's never build anything yet, so the coolant's not even gonna get there. Fuck me. We are dying because our buffer tanks ran out of high. Ah! Probably gonna start really fucking dying, dude. I don't know. Come on, guys. Where are you? What are you guys doing? Okay, we're getting some more oxygen. Yes. Yes. Give us some of that breathable goodness. Even if it's not for long. <laughs> Just give us some.
Okay, that's a nice amount. Even though again half of it is going to the atmosphere. <laughs> and there it's been blocked up. Shit, please. Okay, but there's some oxygen for us. Come on guys, how's it going? How's it going? We need a few more pipes installed. Get it done boys, get it done, come on. Okay, we got the transformer in. What are we waiting for? Yeah, iron. Do we not have iron? We've got 125 kgs, I'm just surprised. Build this! <laughs> mm, dude, this is... I'm getting scared. <laughs> dude, dude. Dudes, dudes, dudes. Build this, please. Please build this. Thank you. Why the fuck was that so hard? That's all being built, that's all being built. Okay, now again, I love you guys, but can you guys get to this? Because <laughs> none of that's going to work if it doesn't happen. Well, I guess the outflow is not going to be that important. It can chow some power quickly for us. STOP TUNING THEM UP! <laughs> oh dude, come on man, we need this shit done yesterday. Okay, it's still, there's still some barely breathable air. <laughs> oh dude, this is rough, this is rough, this is cutting it so close. Oh damn, that was like this as well. Which is careful as well. Mm. A lot of that iron's already been delivered, so building the actual wires is going nice and quick. Nice, nice, nice. And you got a few more to build. Nice. Nice. It has power, it is pumping. Get that last liquid pump built. Come on guys. Come on guys. <laughs> Just need that liquid pump connected and then this thing will. Nice, 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 nice. Yes. Okay. Things are happening. We can do this now. How <laughs> much clay do we have? We don't have a lot of coal yet, so. This is just X core, right? Yeah. Maybe not that much. When we get our hatch ranches a bit better, we will do that. Just to heat up this environment a bit more. So that way this doesn't get cold damage as well. Is it happening? Is it it's happening? Oh my gosh, it's happening. Why does it say no power wire connected? There's definitely a power wire connected. No, there's not. Of course there's not. Because why would there be a power wire connected? Hmm? Hey, you fucking retards. Go build this, please. Thank you. So much. Okay, we got our coolant in, boys. We can start using something that's going to take a little bit more power now. And then hopefully we can breathe. <laughs> and that being said, I don't know if this is going to be enough, so let's also get this thing set up as quickly as possible. Because it will provide a little bit more stuffies for us. Um, yeah, let's get that these wort. These wort. Nice. All of this is going to need power. Where are we going to put that transformer though? Hmm? That is the question. As soon as it's ending, yeah, we could always just do it here. Transformer is going to be hot. Let's not forget that. Okay, we're going to need multiple transformers for this, unfortunately. 
much right now. We can't do more than one, so we're just gonna do one. <laughs> okay, nice and easy to connect. Here's a nice little bridge. Slam that on. These each take 480 watts, which is quite a lot. So I rate each charge to a day. It's phosphorite. Let's remember that and immediately put down a storage bin for phosphorite. Which luckily we do have phosphorite because of our Dracos, which are now should be sustained and should not die ever. So let's hope that happens. Still not time. It's still not that time <laughs> for us to be getting those things. So, Dracos hatch. Oh, there's another one of those fucker bugs, bruh. Or is that the same one I blixed him? I think that's the same one I blixed him to just didn't die. Shadow, you were supposed to eat the bug. <laughs> Why didn't you eat the bug? It looks like some people used it, so hopefully that took a nice little... Nope, so it's nope. Nope, we need consistency right now. When it comes to this, so let's do it like this. This, this needs to all be built nowish. Please and thank you. Yeah, we're gonna make it go that way. We're gonna make it do a hundred volts. And then we say copy settings and shift you all that way. So this way we should now get this hopefully nice and built quickly. And in that way that can get done and dusted as well. And we don't have to worry about it. You know? Okay, we did have a nice oxygen run coming through now, so that was nice. Our atmosphere suits off. We're slowly running out though. So if we could start getting these buffer tanks finished and used, it would be really nice. I do think this is going to help though, because we have this running flat out. Also, for the moment that this starts happening, I want this to be started. Okay, now it just needs power, baby. It just needs this. Which I guess I should make it that this is also all a priority nine. Then. Yeah, so when we get to this ward seat as well, it will be good. This is also going to slowly melt all of this as well, giving us even more water to use to pump back. So very good, very very good. Yes, pump that shit, make us that copper, make us that iron, make us all of that stuff. We even already have some ceramic and refined carbon and tungsten as well. We'll go add all of those things down now. Our food is going down. That seems like an issue. Is this set to the stone hatch things? No, it's not. That's why. There we go. These are priority sixes, right? Yes, they are. Let's just make this a priority six as well, just because. Okay, cool. Yo, they're producing radiation. And I think quite a nice amount of it, right? Yeah, we're connecting 200 and or 600 and something rads per cycle collecting 64 rads per cycle, so we're going to be firing 100 pretty soon. Okay, is this helping? <laughs> is this helping now? Backflow looks a lot less. Let's see if the charge happens, how much we're actually taking. Okay, let's 
not draining, it's not draining very fast. I'm being honest with you, so if that's the case. Okay, okay it's still not draining that fast. Let's get the third one online. <laughs> Generate a hundred by rad bolts per sec per cycle. That way, it will just help get this done. Or not a hundred, three hundred per cycle, which would be nice. If we could just get those built. It would be great. <laughs> Okay, well it looks like it's actually getting somewhere now. I think the moment we add this one on as well, we're going to see a lot more power being drained. So, But hey, then we should get a lot more rad bolts every cycle, so that should be good. Okay, now I really am just going to fucking leave them, because that panic to make sure that we weren't going to die from oxygen, which was still quite a possibility until those suits get filled again. No, this is why I want two power spines, so we can do this again over there, and we're going to obviously do a second one here. You must forget, every now and again, they are going to get engines tuned up, which means, you yeah. know... Maybe we'll finally start using some of those buffer tanks, dude. Looks like it takes a lot longer to fill the batteries up now. Which is good. Okay, now we're going to be getting 300 rad bolts a cycle. That's awesome. We're also slowly filling up our tank as well, which is nice. We can always add multiple layers of this over here to the point that we're getting a shitload of rad bolts. Oh, I'm sorry, baby. What? Well, just straight in the face, Shay. Again, this should not be stopping anytime soon. This should be going now pretty much consistently. I'm hoping. So we obviously add more power to the grid. But then hopefully we'll be doing that by adding more oxygen as well, and we'll be doing it when we need to take more power from the grid. Hey look, we're slowly getting through that, dude. We're, we're gonna maybe even have to start adding a little bit of extra. I don't mind the, the, the coal generators actually working a little bit over time. Yeah, no, that's fine. We, we do that ebb and flow, yeah. <laughs> See, already at 66 rad volts. Nice. Nice. And this thing is doing its thing already up to 245 kgs. Yeah, we always said we were going to do the stuff that needed to be done. Let's go all the way to the top. Uh, 31 tons of fast ride, so that uh, wheeze water should be good. Just for thinking about and wondering, so that's nice. 125 kgs of lime already. 300 kgs of refined carbon. So we're going to be able to make some steel soon. In fact, I think... Let's just do that now. Forever. If we have the stuff, make steel, please. Then we are getting steel a lot earlier than we've gotten before, so that's really nice. Um, what else was I going through? So, yeah. Terrified carbon, all of this stuff. Clay. Which I'm not too worried about. The sand, which we still have so much of. Yes, we now have Wolframite as a thing that we need to keep an eye on. Ceramic as a thing. And okay, but we're making a good amount of progress, like a real good amount of progress now. When did this happen? Just, just when did this happen? How long has this been happening for? Who knows? Luckily, he's in his suit. Press <laughs> uh. time. Okay, I'm gonna go switch out the doggy. Only one last doggy needs to do his rounds. So, yo. Plus, I do think I'm gonna end the stream kinda soonish. We did do a lot, we got a lot done that we wanted to. And I'm sure they'll save me time. So, yo. You know what would help, dude, is if you just did some more things. 
helped out your own situation here? Is even someone stuck down here now? That's awesome. That's that's awesome. I love it when people get stuck. Oh no. No. No 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 no. Sweep it a priority of five, please. Thank you. Okay, you can leave now, buddy. Pretty sure you can leave. Buddy. It's two tiles wide, eh? Jump the gap, motherfucker. You know what? You know, you know, you know. That's it. Take this. No, no. You're a fucking retard. You are what we call retarded. Get, get out of there, Joe. What is happening? 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 What the fuck is going on? Why won't you dig this? They're gonna start running out of oxygen soon. Thank you so much. Just as he was about to start suffocating. We can even cancel this. This is actually still necessary, so let's do that. All the way to the end. Fuck me dead, dude. That was... That was a lot. That was... That... that hmm. At least it's done. Hmm. Okay, cool. Is that Amber? Why are you sleeping here? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? People are crazy. Now for you to go on a journey, bitch. You wanna just sleep? In the middle of nowhere? Okay, our food is running out. We definitely need to focus on that next. For sure. We definitely fired, right, Bolts? Oh. Would help if I did that. Okay, cool. Um, okay, cool. With that in mind, I think it's time. You know what? We can quickly do this as an emergency. That should be enough to help support the colony a little bit more. It's not going to get fertilized or anything, and we are going to get rid of it, but it's just to help keep us going. Um, but we still do have 177,000 calories, there's no good for that. Disgustingness. Yuck. <coughs> Job, dude, water is getting pumped and being used. And I guess we should probably set up a, a filtration system to get it back. I don't want to do that right now. <laughs> um, I want to go change out the doggies because I need to, and then once that's done, I'm gonna have a smoke. And then I think once all because all of this is done, we're gonna finally finish off our hatch ranches and our Draco ranches. And then once that's done, then we're gonna go set up our stuff on the left, yeah. And then once that's done, we're gonna finish off our base and stuff. So yeah, I think that's gonna be a bit of priorities a little bit now. We will add a little pipe system here somewhere in there. In there. It's, not the it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. Okay, I'll be right back.
Yeah, yeah, what are you doing? What do you even want to do? <laughs> um, anyone did? No, okay, cool. So I also know that I said that I was going to focus on the Draco and stuff and all that. I do just also want them to catch up on their tasks for a bit. So let them sweep a bit. I think the planter boxes, which needs to quickly do that before I have the snow, because that should be both done. Have pressure. This is not enough oxygen generation. Yay. Yay. It's even stifling our fucking stuff here now. Yay. Why though? This should be running flat out. Oh, it's because the Atma suits now need to get refilled again and they're also being used at the same time. <sighs> you know what? I don't have the algae right now, but let's just put one in here. Do we have any algae at all? We've got a ton of it. It might help out for a little bit. So. A ton? I don't think a ton. No, a ton. So that can at least help this get back up and running again. Oh my gosh, dude, this is rough. The oxygen generation this run is just by air. That's also a bunch of algae. Let's get that. This is from there. Just, uh, get in here. Get some more of those resources in anyway. Let's add some sand again. Yeah. Yeah, let's just hope that this thing save for the moment. Okay, cool. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure we're gonna be okay. I'm sure everything is gonna be a okay. We we'll get its algae now. We can get some more oxygen generation until the suits get filled. This thing is running flat out pretty much now with the um, with the rad bulk generators going the way they are. So that's good to know. There are times that they can still store stuff, so that's also good. So it's going well. I think it's going well. We also have that third wheeze ward in now, so we're producing how much? Almost 100 rad bolts a cycle per, per thing. So that's almost 300 rad bolts a cycle. I think we already finished our first research from that. Nice. Okay, well, let's. Uh, Oh, dude, I never know what to do next with this stuff. Um, let's do that. Let's do this stuff from top to bottom. Let's just do that. I think it's the smartest thing to do. It has got rad bolts in it. It's storing 95 rad bolts, which will decay over time. So there is that. But your economy achievement has been known. Oxygen not included. And finely tuned machine. Nice. Okay, our calories seem to be fine. I think we're gonna be okay. We're, we're fine. We're fine! We're fine! We're fine! We're fine! I'm gonna have that smoke. We're fine. Also, I should quickly check something on the stream. Are we still good? Yeah, no, everything's fine. Nobody's dying, not even any yellow warnings. Looking good. Looking a lot better. Okay, and grab that smoke. And we always were going for three hours. That's
Okay, oh I'm sorry, shit, I kicked you in the face again. <laughs> okay, let's get back to it. Okay, cool. How are we doing over here? Are you guys actually picking up the stuff, sweeping the things that I want you to sweep? Are you guys getting to the things, the dupes? Oh, we, we could do with the calories, especially my fruit. Hey, we can finally do cooling. Which... I wasn't expecting to get so quickly. We first need to do so much other things. <laughs> like, we do genuinely need to do a lot of other things before we can do that. I mean, not really. We can do it right now, but I feel like we're going to start giving up tasks way too much. And these dudes... Yeah, it's getting low, guys. <laughs> I mean, there aren't too many projects down here, so I'm not too worried if there's only one or two suits available right now. Once it's really low, we'll shut it down for a bit until we have some more oxygen generation happening. So it seems like each power, power spine is going to need two of these systems to make sure that we can make sure that the Atmos suits are filled and we're pumping a good amount of oxygen in everything. Okay, let's go to this one next. People are high stress, gamer demon, and Johan. Both have high stress. I don't know why. They should hopefully start calming down a bit more. Even though the atmospheres are going to be going away again. <laughs> uh, why are you guys sleeping here? You are not narcoleptic, motherfucker. Amber, here is your cart. Why aren't you... It's not even your sleeping time. What are you doing? Exhausted. Why are you exhausted? I think it's because of the slime lung. Yeah, I think it might be Shea's slime lung. No. She doesn't. She's just exhausted. I don't know why. I don't know what's happening there. I'm sure she'll be fine. <sighs> there might also be time to set up a, a massage parlor place. I just don't know where we're going to do it. I also do think it's time that the dupes got to this. Let's drain this bitch. Our water is getting lower, so it would be nice. And this water is quickly rising. Like I said, I wanted to spill out for quite a while, up until like here. Yeah, so it can melt all of this. Turn it into more water and then we'll pump it all out. But we are making a lot of refined materials. How far have we gotten with the 7288? Oh, it's not got a lot. Do we have steel yet? I thought I saw steel yet. We do. Why is that not pop up over yet? Maybe I saw it and I didn't realize it. That's not what I clicked. Uh, where is that steel? Steel. We've already got 800 kgs of steel. Nice. Start doing some work with the aqua tuners and things now. So they don't get damage. Which again is really nice, but there's just certain things right now that are not the best. Our oxygen generation is really bad. And our food is going down. Just putting that out there. Once they drain this, I think we're going to start expanding, yeah? I think it's time. I think it's time. Oh, not that last one though. Hmm? Maybe from here. 
I want to put our second power spine probably around about here ish. Yeah, that gives me a basis to where I want this stuff. to not spill that water though. <laughs> I really prefer. Well, isn't sand gonna fall? We need to dig this out though. This we can get to. Pretty sure that sand it's, it's funny if it falls here because then it goes here and it takes a while to cool up and stuff. Water is currently being split, which I don't like. We're gonna have to mop a lot of that up. <laughs> this actually sucks, we're gonna probably lose a little bit of water, yeah? And we've been really good at actually keeping our water separate this game. So I'd like to keep it that way <laughs> for as long as possible. See now this is an issue because it's pulled the yeah. We just need to start getting that second bit built so that we can start getting more oxygen in our base. Because it is just wrecking us right now. Just absolutely wrecking us. There is more water coming in, yeah, so we did succeed in that at least a little bit. But we are definitely going to need to pump all of this in here as well, because we're going to be running even more electrolyzers. And we still have yet to think find earlier, guys. We do have a lot of polluted water and a lot of salt, salt water around. And like I said, I think this is going to be our salt water basin. Problems just keep popping up there. I want to let the dupes do their thing and get to things, but we need to build this power spine now. We don't have time to focus on other things. If the calories really start getting low, I'll start just spam planting mealwood. My big issue that I'm really worried about is our oxygen. Like, I'm really worried about our oxygen. Like, we're barely making it right now. They're almost done with this. But then they're gonna get back to this and whatever water we lose, we lose. I'm fine with it, it is what it is. Oof, no research was selected. It's good. Botanical analyzer is another thing. I think this is a research building as well. So we can put it in here. Just for the future, so it's out of the fucking way, so I don't forget about it. Not that we're going to use it right now. Oh, we're running out of some power. They finally chowed through everything, huh? <laughs> That's fine. There's a nice, easy way to get to deal with this. Let's just do this. 
snippity, and there we go. Should be a little better now. <laughs> so now we're working too hard. <laughs> now there's no backlog at all, which will change now that that second one's off. It should be fine. Oh, looks like it's not, so let's maybe disconnect this one as well. Like I said, we got our steam generation, so I'm not I'm not super empty pipe. So I'm not super bugged by it. I'm not super bugged by it. With the metal refinery running now, all these things running, we're actually able to keep up with our power supply for once. And we're not creating a backlog, which is really nice. Looks like we are able to, with just one of them running, build back up. Definitely still not getting you dude, you dupes right now with our food and our oxygen the way that it is. Okay, that's the last bit of liquid you're gonna mark. Because this is lost. Unfortunately, this did end up breaking, which sucks. Should we try hard not to break it? But it's fine. It is what it is. In fact, with that being the way that it was, just do this now. Yeah, let's just do that. Get it out of the way. We'll delete, deconstruct those ladders once it's built. Okay, but then we need to copy this power spine again, which I uh, always love doing. Maybe now I don't need a picture. Let's see if I can remember to do it how to do it without a picture. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're gonna come in here, we're gonna have our smart batteries over here. So and wait, so this needs to be so let's cancel that before it comes an issue. Let's dig all this up as well. Okay. You can make that four high just to get a bit more resources. Okay, let's plan this out nicely, okay? So we're gonna want our batteries. How long have we been doing this? How long have we been doing this? How many of our insulated tiles are made out of igneous rock? It doesn't look like a lot. These are all sandstone. Where's our igneous rock, bro? Where did that shit go? We had zero kgs. That shit's gonna starve. How are there so many issues, dude? <laughs> Fuck me. Yo. Okay, that's a little scary. We need to start strip mining this this whole area now, pretty much. Fuck, dude. Okay, this colony is starting to get a little bit out of hand. We maybe should have rushed with a few things <laughs> a little bit more. Cause fuck, this is an issue now. This is kind of a serious issue. How many of you are starving? seen it pop up yet. But with zero kgs you guys have just eaten I think in the last but I think you might have caught that just in time. And that's a pretty condos a little bit down. That's always nice. There's no space for it though. Shame. <laughs> uh another water for it. Okay. Yeah we're busy with that. Getting some igneous rock now, at least two tons of it. 
gonna go away very quickly though, so like I said, I think we should start ship mining this place. Sure that worked out beautifully, dude. <laughs> That actually ended up working out pretty well. It's just this part, yeah. But once they've dug up, then we can, you know, put the rest of the ladders in. But yeah, so this is where the one is going to go. And then you have seven down one. Seven. I think we could be taking it one tile down, but it's fine. a huge cause to buy on this. Hopefully we'll get a lot of igneous rock out of this. Okay. Oh, there's a thingy there. That's not good. So we need a way to get around that, obviously, while we're mining. So. Let's do that. In general, I like to have ladders next to it for later on. Can we get one lower? <laughs> and we can somehow come here and do things, so that's nice. But yeah, we need a lot more igneous rock. We need to strip mine the shit out of this place. We need to get onto here and do the same thing. And oh my gosh, we're falling behind. Our oxygen's running out. You guys are just not feeling it. Now I have to disable this building. Which we have an easier way to do. Let's do that the proper way. So we don't have to wait for a dupe to come do it. So hopefully this will mean now that we can do a bit more. Igneous rocks are already at 11 tons, so that makes me a lot happier. It's even some yeah, it looks like. Might as well mine all of that out as well. I don't know how far wide they can dig. I don't know if they can dig three wide. If not, that's gonna suck. I really hope they can. Doesn't look like they can, because otherwise I think you'd be digging, yeah. I don't know, I think you can. <sighs> Calories are still going up. We still seem to be doing fine. I'm not seeing suffocating messages and stuff like that, so... It is what it is. This is also getting there. How much ores do we have left? 16 tons. Ooh, we've got fossil. Nice. 
16 tons, gold amalgams 11 tons, cobalt ores 19 tons, iron ores 10 tons, wolframite is finished. So we're getting there. We do have enough metals to actually do all of that, so gonna be a bit hectic. Joe, so let's strip mine this biome as much as possible. Give us a bunch of room to also work in here if we want to do stuff. We are getting there. That being said, I'm very nervous. I'm not gonna lie, I'm very nervous. <laughs> like it's nice that we all swept up and stuff and things are kept up there, but I'm I'm scared. <laughs> we are we are running low on a lot of things that need to be kept up on. Now that this has been loaded, we can technically do some like stuff here. As we slowly build in the time, it lets us still build. And then we'll massage parlor over here. Not a big one. We're not going to connect it up right now because we're going to connect it to the other spine. But just so that it has, you know, we put two massage tables in. So two people can come in here and chill. Then it needs decor. What does it need again? I feel like it needs something weird. No notion that just decor. Just decor. We have a lot of decor now. Um a lot of sculpting block there. Do flower pots to make it nice. Can also do these. If we want to do not crown moldings. Let's do that. So one day when that's ready, they can do that as well. Sam, hello. <laughs> okay, we're going well. It's going well with the strip mining. Making some good progress. Our igneous rock is now at 34 tons. So I think we should be good. People making messes. Oh, that's why. That's an issue. They can't get back. Well, they technically cannot get back. Brandon, what the fuck, dude? He's trapped through your dupes down there, man. What are you doing? <laughs> Please stay dug. <laughs> there we go, you guys are all free. <laughs> you guys are all free, I'm sorry. <laughs> Grabbing that polluted dirt, my guy. <laughs> There's some more priority polluted dirt to grab, but I guess thank you. How much is this already? So yeah, this is going to heat up pretty quickly as well. Like it is in a coal biome, we've got a lot of the best light. There's barely anything happening. Yeah, should probably change this in the long run, seeing as it is. So the actual heat transfer here is going to be really maintained into this building. So that's what I'm saying, we should put a lot of our heat stuff related things in here. I'm going to let this overflow. I know it's a bad idea, but I'm going to let it overflow. Maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should have built it a bit lower. At least our hatches aren't gonna die. We have our first glossy Draco in his little two. That's cute. Yeah, I guess it's let's let's do it. Let's get started with the next one. Even though we don't have a weasel yet.
I'm gonna connect this shearing station still up to our normal grid. I know I shouldn't, I'm going to. It's not like it's used that much. Copper, yes. Okay, and then I'm gonna copy this. Copy this. This, by the way, should be um, green fiber, <laughs> so we can store it there. <laughs> but it is what it is. Yeah, well, there's a second one built. Once it's built, I'll say to go store glossy dracos there, and that'll be that. How long they'll survive? Who knows? Who knows? I know we don't have the seeds, fucker. Don't sass me, game. <laughs> Looking good. Okay, so as we do get wheeze warts, they are going to get planted, yeah? To help keep the Dracos alive. That better just be water. Yeah, it is. Oh shit, no, it's salt water. No! Where did that come from, dude? Too much liquid? Are you shitting my nuts? No, we did so well. Ah, oh, motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck you, game. How much is it? It's 500k, jeez, dude. Oh, it's still... Okay, guys. 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 Actually, like... All of this, please do it now. Please fucking do it now. Please mop it all. There comes more. Can't believe all that salt water got in there, dude. That's gonna fuck up our electrolyzers later. <laughs> no, no, we're doing so well. <laughs> Dehydrated and rehydrated and gas range. I don't know what that is. I don't know what any of this late material stuff is. Insufficient resources. Yeah, I don't know. I don't get it. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah, buffer tanks are completely gone. We are actually now short on power. This has been built, so let's disable that. Let's quickly pause while we've got you to unequip the suit. Unequip the suit. Let me set suits. That's where I told you to unequip your suit. Okay, well, now our spare suits here yeah, at a 13% durability. <laughs> But now that it's off, let's let them recharge it. They can also go in here a bit more freely. Which means stress is going to go up again. Which we're finally getting a down. But it's fine. And he's letting these guys charge up for a bit. Also, where are these guys? So where is that other suit? Wait, what? Is this not disabled? Or were you in here this whole time? On a quick shoot. Yeah, no, it's off. It's off. They're not doing that. Good. Okay, cool. 
Suits have been delivered. All is being charged up now again. That's nice to know. They also have started to build this, which is good. Our food seems to be stabilizing, our oxygen seems to be okay. Got a little bit of algae left, I think. <laughs> they struck mining now, it suddenly slowed down because priorities, I think, are now elsewhere again. I don't know where, but elsewhere. Oh, yeah. It is going to be the Glosso. Fine if priority was here, we didn't need to do this, so now it's up and running. Now we can start getting glossy drinkers as well. Do we have mirth leaf? We do. This is rough guys, this is really rough. I guarantee you this is going to need to go down further, so might as well just do that. Get it done and dusted. Okay, then I guess while they're doing all this, let's think about how we're going to do this, right? So, uh, insulated tiles. Let's actually check how big we made this thing. I should get the blueprints mod, dude. I should really get the blueprints mod. And just copy it over, like just like this, and copy it on over there, I mean we don't want to do that because we want to flip it, but it is what it is, yeah, how many tiles, 68 tiles, so 17 by 4, so 17 tiles, so we want it to be done. That can be our judgment for everything. Nice. Four. Five, then. One, two, three, four, yeah. Five. I have fucked this up before and then I have to rebuild everything again, so just give me a second. Four. Tack everything there. <laughs> and then let's give all this out as well. Okay. Fucked. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> Bitch. Okay, cool. So now that all that will be done, let's start placing down all the things. This doesn't necessarily need. Three tiles is not really what I want. I kind of want it to be four tiles just to maintain. Let's do it. I should remember to do this. Before we forget. Okay, what you giving us? Steel, nice. Okay, looking good, yeah. Looking nice. Let's start with the power. Well, yeah, let's start with the stations, I guess. Well, no, actually, let's start with the coal generators. In the stations. Our control station, yeah. And we can even put it over here, yeah, which would be weird. Try and do that. And three. Then we want our coal generated. Three. And our electrolyzers. Gas bumps. 
damn it. Okay. And we know we let them get to that. But they first need to strip mine this whole place. Mm -hmm. Where they can't get here anymore. Pretty no one will stop doing that. Mm -hmm. But once they strip mine this, I mean, we should have so much ore and stuff like that, and minerals and resources and all of those good things, all of those great good things. Okay. Joe, we are getting the second one built now. I'm gonna run it. Run the power spine up here to start charging some things. Yeah. And also running some oxygen <laughs> to get this side of the base. we are going to officially make, I think. I think we need to get rid of those ladders, we kind of did because we're going to move it up, but you are going to make the next ladder run about here, yeah, I think. So we still have that space. So, yeah. Just so we can remember, you know. Like, hey, that's where we're getting the stuff. <laughs> So when we pump our ventilation and stuff through, it'll be a big issue. Let's maybe do our ventilation now. No, because we can't because of that. That's fine. So three is going to be there usually, if I'm not mistaken. One, two, one, two, one, two, three. No. Like that. There, but just flip it. it. Shouldn't be that big of a deal. So then instead we're gonna go from yeah. One, two, one, two, two. Just like that. That way we can do our thing yeah. This is weird, alone. And then once it gets backed up, we're gonna have the gas reservoirs coming out. Okay, cool. That's the hydrogen line sorted out, and that line sorted out, and we need everything that isn't hydrogen. Okay, now, yeah, we need to be careful. That should be perfectly fine. Guys, but should be yeah, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, yeah, 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 that should be good. That should be good. I'm sure, that's fine. Okay, and then it's gonna go in, it's gonna come out as the oxygen, no, and then come out as carbon dioxide, or anything else that's got us. And then that oxygen is going to go all the way to the this side of the base, which we'll pump up later. Which we're going to build it up here, and then that way we have oxygen coming here and oxygen coming here. this is still so little because this is still busy being filled up. Luckily we have enough power and it's constantly running. <laughs> it's never not running. <laughs> Oh, 
Also, I'm only really noticing one or two of these gas bombs work. Just saying. If only there was a way to improve my system. <laughs> to have like these gas bombs. I think it's the filter that's slowing me down because they have to, yeah, go through two filters constantly. I think that's the limiting factor there. So we might not even need to put in all of these other gas pumps in the future. We should keep that in mind because it does waste time adding all those other gas pumps. In fact, we'll probably try it out with this one here. Just add the two gas pumps and that's it. Okay, the strip mining is going well. It's happening. Our, our Ignis rock is up to 43 tons now, so I'm feeling a lot better about that. We also have a thousand. We have a ton of, of ceramic right now as well, which is pretty crazy. This is filling up like nut sacks. So let's actually get a priority of do it now, please. And let's deconstruct that. And do it now. I know it's cock in there, guys. I know it's shit. Okay, then it looks like we're gonna need to also. You gotta deal with this now, I guess. Yay. <laughs> Which, what we are gonna do is pretty much just follow this line back. That's all we're doing. We just wanted to be able to sit in the different pools to exchange temperatures for a little bit. Keep it straight, keep it straight, keep it straight, keep it straight. Nice. <laughs> we kept it straight. I don't mind this thing getting stifled for a bit because it also just means that this isn't going to be able to be used as much and it can take some downtime, some chill time. Because we're already up to a ton and a half of steel, half a ton of tungsten, uh, two and a half tons of iron ore, almost three tons of copper. We haven't done any gold yet, yet though, because I'm not seeing, oh, well, we probably just haven't selected it yet. That's what I'm assuming. We're up to almost five tons of gold and seven tons of cobalt. So the cobalt, I think, and the copper we're going to be using for our like miscellaneous shit. And that gold's going to come in handy as well as that steel to build some systems with aqua tuners and things like that. I forgot about research. <laughs> okay, we're making progress with this though. Once we're done with all of these, which is a lot, <laughs> then we'll start moving on to the next layer. Mini liquid pumps, got those last time. Mini gas pumps, got those last time as well. I'm gonna be able to go get my, to go get the doggos now for the last time so we don't have to worry about them for a bit then. Okay, well, let's maybe do our plumbing here next. So it's out of the way. Oh my. Nice, pure fifty fifty split. Okay, so that's that. Ventilation is pretty much done. We just have to do the. Uh, I can build the filter. Let's not forget that I can build the first filter. 
always forget that I can build the first filter like this. Not like this, but we're gonna swap it. Yes. Yes. Uh, I guess we can do this along as well. Because it is pretty much just going to go up along here. Nice. Up until where we did this one pretty much. So then, yeah. One, two over. And then I rate. We're just gonna let the oxygen go out there for now. We fill up the Atmo suits. Which, yeah, for now this is pretty useless, so. But we'll get rid of it all. Mm -hmm. And then our oxygen can pour in the air as well. It's looking okay. We're okay. We're fine. Mm -hmm. Everything's fine. Everything is okay. <laughs> and getting that second thing set up now, finally, which is taking forever. Which we're going to do powering once we get a little bit more in here and we can see a bit more. And then we're going to be able to do that. And then we'll set up our batteries and everything. We're also going to have our heavy wiring running all the way up to here, basically. So that we can put some transformers here and we can even run it up if we want to and tap it over there we could keep running it up no yeah because our ladder system should be here which means we're going to want some rooms here so we're going to keep the heavy wire wiring on here yeah. and then we'll put the transformer here and then run the wire yeah It'd be a bit more expensive for the conductor wiring but it's fine also, if you don't have anything to sweep my eye, <laughs> there's some shit for you to sweep. Lots of shit for them to do, not gonna lie. How is our fucking igneous rock now? At 47 tons, suck my dick, stone hatches. <laughs> yeah, we still need to do that as well. But it still doesn't have plastic because they haven't done this yet. Nice. <laughs> Getting even more copper ore, which we're down to 6 tons now, just saying. Like up to 16 tons of cobalt ore though. Okay, this thing should hopefully stop soon. And be like, hey, I'm overpressured. Stop it. <laughs> that being said, we're making good progress. We're making really good progress. I think we're out of refined carbon. No, we're still making some refined carbon. How much coal do we have? 108 tons. I'm gonna save the rest of that coal for you now, build our next couple coal generators until we have the rest of our hatch farms built and ready to go. And yeah, we can make little rooms here as well. Or what we can do is always expand these rooms to do something else. Um, like we can also always expand this here and put a greenhouse here and just make it a second grid farm first. Um, but that seems like a pretty bad thing. Amber, are you gonna die? Are you gonna die, Amber? You're not gonna die, okay. Always fun times, yeah, in the colony. Okay, speaking of which, I'm gonna save and I'm gonna go move our doggos for the last time. That being said, I probably am gonna end the stream in the next hour. I think I'm gonna have one more smoke. Go for one more hour, if even. Um, and then I'm probably going to end it. Well, I hope no one dies. We did save, though. We did save. 
We did save, said so Colin. We did save. Colin is looking good, though. Not really. It's struggling. I shouldn't say it's looking good. It's struggling quite a lot. There's just issues everywhere, so... We'll see how it goes. <laughs> Dogs are not sorted for this. Nice. Anybody dying? No. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Now, the moment the second power is finally set up and our oxygen should be good, then that I can slow down for a bit, I think, for the first time in a long time, and actually focus on the things that I need to get done, like getting our branches finished up, um, getting our sorts of plastic coming in. All of those things, finishing off the base is interior as well, like the middle part. I think do a rec room maybe, some other things to just help with morale. There's a lot of things that we need. Lots and lots of things that we need. But yeah, this is probably gonna be the last hour. Like I said, if even that, probably might even be 30 minutes. Um, I don't think we're going to finish the second power spine today. But we got the first one done with our metal refinery. We already have steel. So I'm winning. I'm, I think it's winning. No progress was made. As long as we don't die. That's just my big thing is we must not die. No research focused. Okay. Uh, they get us aeropods. Those are nice. Making progress here. Not seeing anyone getting stuck. We're gonna put our atmosphere checkpoints in here soon as well. We should probably actually do that next when we get back. Let's put the atmosphere checkpoints in. Yeah, more stuff to fill. Which, by the way, these are almost full again. Yay! <laughs> which means the base's oxygen levels should be better, and they should hopefully not run out this time because we're not getting a backlog of cars. And remember, these are going to be two separate power spines. So right now, this one's going to stay like this even when we add juice to our power spine. It's two separate ones. So this is going to provide, right now, pretty much this all is going to just... We'll separate some things, or we'll... I guess we'll add a bunch of stuff that could take power. Like, I think maybe... What we'll do is, is we'll add a bunch of little rooms here, right? Like single um, massage parlors. So that way we have a bunch of power it's coming off with just that for now, and we can disconnect them in time. I think that's going to be the play, just to make sure the oxygen is pumping. Then our oxygen should be sorted. We then can get all of our other stuff built and you know ready for what we need to get going for later game stuff. All right, and then we can finally, once all of that's finally done, we can start with cooling and probably cycle. I don't fucking know. So yeah, we also definitely need to get cooling done.
are we looking? Looks like we're doing good though. They're still getting to work on this, which I'm happy with. They must do it. I want them to do it. Because once this has been stripped mine, I think I don't have to worry then about certain things for a while. Which would be nice. There wasn't a lot of coal in there, which kind of sucks. Mm -hmm. Got a lot of phosphorite, I think, from it, which is nice. And he has a bunch of algae, apparently. So. Gonna be able to keep that algae diffuser going. Take the little copper, that's always nice. Okay, these things must almost be full. Almost. Almost there. Soon we will no longer be pumping it in anymore. So every now and again a little blob gets in there, which is annoying because then it slows it and broke down. Those are still creating re fiber for us. We're getting re fiber. Yeah. If we could build this, then we could start getting plastic as well, which is really cool. I think you're also almost, you're probably almost, uh, no, you are green with plastic. Okay. Yes, yeah, so I think tomorrow we'll finish. Oh, well, there's enough space to technically do it now. Let's. Let's do it. That fucking thing is in the way, but sure. Okay. Into the tower, this thing. All the way. How many batteries is it? Two. I think I wanted to put three, but we're surviving on two, so let's just put two. But we need to make it big enough for the transformers if it's six towers long. Cool. Take all this crap out as well, please. Add smart batteries, copper. Mm -hmm. We should actually use all of our cobalt. We have so much of it, dude. Oh, I think I made this too small. Shitty nuts. So now we can actually do the wiring as well. Which is not easier than you think it is. I made it out to be a lot harder last time. The wiring is actually pretty basic. Also, whoops. <laughs> Forgot about these. What am I cancelling? What did I cancel? Nothing. I'm cancelling four four because I'm not in the right over there. Okay, cool. There we go. Now we can do the wiring. Yeah, I like the heavy one to run on the ladder. Yeah. stuff with eventually. Okay, cool. Yeah, this needs to go like this. I don't know what I was thinking. Let me have to run through there. We have to put a fucking door there. Let's actually do all the doors. Because I'm clearly forgetting them. Nice and smart today. Nice and smart. Like we didn't even put the thing there. <laughs> it's because we can't. 
Okay, then got all that set up, so now let's do the conductor wiring, which we're also going to make out of cobalt. Highly thermally conductive, it's the same as copper, just copper adds an overheat temperature. Maybe we should make this out of copper. <laughs> Maybe. Down our smart battery so long as well for you. Yeah. Okay, so we can have the heavy wiring connection done. I'm already in power. <laughs> system here and we'll probably have it be what the atmosphere docks we we'll have it be about yearish be the other ones yeah nice space for rooms there okay you know atmosphere docks which will be in the station so Well, uh, we are going to have to seal this place off properly. It's four tiles high. Up to there. So the door is technically going to be here. Okay, we should actually make that an airlock. Lessen the shit getting out. Okay, then we do our atmosphere checkpoints, which we need 12. Let's hope we can get that in. Just enough, and then we can put something else in here, like a deodorizer or something, if we need to ever do that. Ooh, nice. Got a bit slight chest, it shouldn't bother us, um, but that's nice. There's some water for us. And I do have a new system compared to our old one that will work better for this. So that's very nice. That, that makes me happy. So then, with that all set up, we can also now do our ventilation properly. And seeing as it is just so close to our main power spine, let's just connect it up. Baby. It's not like it's going to be that bad of an issue. I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay, cool. And our window tiles as well. That's quite cool. And the sun lamp and the aeropods. And we also have the power outlet. Nice. Uh, what's next? What to do next? I wonder. Sure, let's go get ourselves our oxalite and molecular forge and the bleachstone hopper. 
Those seem pretty cool as well, and we can use them later. We're getting through a lot of our research really quickly though. Hey, we got our first bit of plastic as well. Let's go add that to our list of stuff we can see. So I like to see how much plastic we have. There it is. So now we have plastic and steel already, which is pretty cool. Yes. Okay, that's really nice. That's really nice. And as we get closer, eggs will pop in here. Um, yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah, we still need a place to dump all that fucking salt water, which really sucks. And this water is running out, so we must make sure we keep an eye on that when it gets to about here ish. We must not pump this water in. That must definitely be a thing. Yeah, let's make sure that we can make another gas. Yeah, there we do that yeah, as well. Oh, 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 there's so much to do. And then we need to make a third trekker on, and then finally we can finish that off, but that will come later. Okay, joy seats are nice. Very nice. They have very nice livable ranges. Which is always a nice thing. Okay, so now we just need to wait for this thing to get set the fuck up, and then once it's. I guess we don't have to really wait. We can do the transformers now. Let's do two. They will connect up to here. Now we're going to keep them the same level as these, this doesn't really matter to me at all. So, I have cobalt because we have so much. Ah. <laughs> There's one done. And we'll connect these up to some other rooms that we're going to make now. Absolutely must not forget that. Uh, the ladders are going to be there. Wait, no, it's fine then. Yeah. Because those ladders are going to be destroyed. So fireball there. And tubes there. Nice. Yeah. So we're going to have to get rid of this one. Because the fireballs are going to be on this side now. So up this way then instead. Okay, boom, 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 boom. So now those rooms will all have their own little designated thingy. Seeing as they're not as big, we're only going to give them one massage table, I think. Maybe we'll put two still in. Two next to each other, maybe? Seems like a nice idea. And this should hopefully chow some power. <laughs> that is what I'm hoping it is going to do. I don't know though. So, 240 per, right? Yeah, this is 248. I'm sure this would be enough for 2000. <laughs> it's been enough of these. That's pretty much it. So these then are gonna have to go also on the long run and journey. 
It's gonna run through it in the boat. Just to make it a little easier to get to, you know? This unfortunately is all going to be in a tile, though. And they're not going to be able to get to, but yeah. Nope, that's the wrong button. Oh, I've got on pause. I'm like wondering what is happening? Why is no. I'm not seeing anybody have it paused. <laughs> Yeah, then we also want to have to now decorate this place. So let's go to furniture. Where is that large sculpting block? Boom. Now pot room. Boom. 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 And then I reckon do some make it just look nice because I think that decor should be enough. Okay, for some reason it's not letting us, not letting us place it. But it is going to be in the corner. It will be one day. Yeah, we're completely forgetting about this one. Ooh, and it's also getting drywall going. It's a nice relaxing drywall. I think just a nice white. Now let's make it grey. It's the default grey. So now that we're starting to get plastic, we can also technically... So I think over here is we're going to start building our next barracks. And then we can start moving some carts over and start doing some private bedrooms. Which would be really nice. Okay, now I've given them a shitload to do. Go do the things you need to do, dupes. There's a lot to do now. <laughs> Have we been getting it back up? Uh, slightly, but that's kind of where we want it. That's a nice backup. Tanks are not being filled. That's good. I like that. That shouldn't change until we do tap into this. Or until we build another oxygen machine. Which right now, it's still not the best. Very much barely breathable, which is not what I like to see. But hopefully with this all set up the way that it is, once this gets built, there will be a little bit more oxygen in our system. I also think let's maybe get some airflow tiles in already, preemptively as well. Because I don't want shit not flowing properly. Ooh, cancel that. Cancel that. Actually also cancel those. And then all the hydrogen. Put it over here. Now it needs to be two tiles. Yeah, no, no that's just not getting any airflow tiles, apparently. 
Yeah, it's really got some in there. That's really got some in there. Yeah, we should be fine. I just want to make sure you can get from that side to this side. There's a bunch of airflow tiles now. It should help a lot more. Ah, yeah, it's got a manual airlock, bitches. So most of that shit should just drain. Okay, cool. Then we'll also have what? We need to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight dupes worth of stress relief. Which is very good. <laughs> so this is finally good to go. So no more dupes will be suffering in there anymore. This is all clean oxygen yet, yeah, just putting that out there as well. I'm just going to finish building this. Also, whatever happened to this system? Oh, they're still building it. We'll get there. There's a lot of things to do. I understand. <laughs> We don't really need to be making a lot more refined things right now. We've got a lot of refined materials. We have, oh, I thought it said we have 250 tons of gold amalgam. I was like, what? <laughs> we need to be using that. <laughs> no, it's granite. A lot of granite. Now, igneous rock is at 55 tons now. So we've actually strip mined this place quite nicely, which I'm very happy about. And we still have some here, which we can go and strip mine. And we can even go further in here. Not that there's a lot of igneous rock here. And obviously we need to find another course to buy as soon as possible. Ah, here we go. Cool. And then we can go into here for some more. Okay, cool. Lots of building to do, guys. Lots of things to do. You guys are going to be busy, 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 busy. Busy little bees, but it's fine. I still do think we'll be able to get to everything. I do think so. It'll probably take about a hundred cycles. <laughs> But I think we're going to be able to get to everything. As long as our oxygen kind of just stays in this limbo situation where we're fine, which we did get a bunch of algae, so I think. Where's that organic? Where's organic? At the bottom. So let's wait for it to load. Oh, we only have 900 kgs out to left. So that's soon going to become a problem. Again. <laughs> There's some here. There's some here. I just remember that there's some here. So we will be fine if we need to. If we're suddenly like, well, oxygen is pretty bad, then we can go do that. More research? I oh, don't know, not yet. As it's looking nice. We're getting a little bit of storage, but it's happening so slowly that I'm very much okay with that. I'm very much okay with that. We've got all this hydrogen gas here as well that we can start using for our records later. Pumping that all in there. Nice. Dispersal seeds, nah. Decontamination, nah. Lead suit protection, yeah. <laughs> that sounds like something I want. Also, looking good. We're actually making progress with things. Still haven't done this top one yet, though. You know, it's been a fuck long, like been a fuck long time since we've done this. How is that going to be around here? Let's get you better building, Amber. All you like is building. Well, if that's the case, let's get you carrying. Devin, he likes his farming, and he's digging, which he's now gotten. Let's get him some carrying. Game of Demon. Has this already taken everything she likes? So, uh, hmm. Mm -hmm. Do that, I guess. We'll get you in here. 
unfortunately. When he thought we can. Uh, Suit sustainability. Let's get that. And maybe improve team color. Jamie, you like digging. Let's get you your digging. Jax, you wanted to become a mechatronics engineer. We caught you that. And you're dying. <laughs> so let's leave you alone. Master works in place. And you did start with that. So let's get you that. You are now carrier. He's an absolute beast right now. I think let's get you some t nothing. <laughs> Oops, I wasn't done. Push. Do you like digging? So let's get you all of your digging that you can get. So put you a bit over morale, but it's fine. Sinister likes the tidying. Let's get him his tidying. And then let's get him some rocketry pilot. Make him a little bit faster. Up here was our boulder digger in the beginning. He can now dig and build very nicely. Top of that, he does have the carrying weight. Let's give him some more athletics as well. Let's get people fast. Let's get them running. Let's get them moving. Which is going really well. We're actually we're doing stuff. Like I say, things are happening. This doesn't necessarily need to be prioritized, but at the same time, I prefer to have this all built so that once this goes, we have power consumers chugging away so we don't have a backlog. Even though stress isn't very high right now. <laughs> so, uh, we could always start building some rooms in here. They could start taking power. Like, the jukebox. Let's maybe make a rec room. Yeah. Let's do that. Yeah, I was going to say, this should be the right size. Some more water for us, nice. Somehow we got to that. I don't know how we nailed those ladders so nicely, but we fucking nailed those ladders, dude. Mm -hmm. Ah, this one we didn't nail. Okay, so there's just a few more rooms for us to do. So I do think these two are going to be the barracks, and in this we can make the ring. Yeah. Yeah. So the rec room is going to need some recreational stuff. Let me just get the jukebox in here. That should be nice. Get the mechanical surfboard in here. That should be good. Because um, they don't require anything except for you to just have your dupes sit on it and have fun, right? So yeah, let's just get the party line phone in here for some dupes later. I don't actually mind using the water cooler. It'll be nice. What else? And then I think the deck will needs to come in. Get some more sculpting blocks in here. Some flower pots. Put one there. Um, let's get one metal block of cobalt, and it's and it's put it like yeah. There's still enough space for one more building here. There's like two more <coughs> things here that we can put down. So let's do it now. I want to put pot there and pot there. Let's just get one more metal. Let's hope to some more copper. Yeah. Well, actually, no, you know what? That's actually maybe not a good idea. It's actually. Let's keep forgetting. We can, we can do paintings. We can just do paintings, which would be pretty cool. And then we get our 
the mines in. I'm happy with that. That's a nice record. There's a lot of decor there. They're gonna be chilling and having fun. And now what's nice is, is we can also connect this up to this power here. Yeah. So let me try and copy it. As long as we are using our board, let's use some fire. Then we also have a rec room. Nice. That feels good. I like that. I like that a lot. It's the first time we'll ever have a rec room. And duplicates can come in here to tell a lot. They can call people over the party line. They can jam at the jukebox. They can chill at the water cooler. They can do a bunch of that stuff. And it's right by the massage clinic as well. So this is like a de stress zone. And there is going to be beds here as well. Unfortunately, these guys are not as close to the bedrooms, but these guys aren't as close to the bathrooms, so... It's like these guys are not as close to the rec room and the de-stress stuff, but these guys aren't as close to the bathroom and stuff, so... It's, it's, it's you know, it's a win-win. Lose-lose. <laughs> also, let's build the rest of these ladders, I think. Just so that it's out of the way. So it's out of the way, you know. Okay, these buildings are already done and being painted and everything, so that's really nice. Okay, we're looking a lot better. Our calories have gone up quite a bit, which is nice. Uh, this system still isn't built, so we're not able to use anything. So I don't actually want to have dupes really coming here right now. I'm being 100% honest, I don't know where that liquid came from. Okay. Because that way it keeps the atmosphere charged. If the atmosphere are charged, we have more oxygen coming into our base. <laughs> Not a lot, though. Not nearly as much as I would like, but it's fine. Awaiting some bad balls. Yes. We've got another achievement. I have a duplicate nice to the master works. Nice. Do we have more research to do? That was the on that. To be waiting for rad balls, which is fine. Water's still fine. Unfortunately, we are making a huge fucking mess of everything here, so... Probably just a good idea to just sweep all this up. Man, they've got... The, whoever our, like, dedicated tidy is, is probably just running and running and running and running. Because there is someone, as far as I remember, that I just said to, you must just tidy. Yuan. Yuan just supplies stores and tidies and then he does some life support every now and again. So the man's busy. <laughs> Do we have an oxide refinery and bleach stone hopper and molecular forge now? Stuff that we've never used, but we'll put it in the soda fountain. Nice. That I believe requires carbon dioxide and like, water and stuff, so we'll probably leave that alone for now. Until we get our vents tamed and stuff like that. Which this already has quite a nice amount of water coming in here. It's really, this even isn't even hot water. Nice. Also, I realize we should probably do this. Hmm. Gonna be kind of hard for them to get to where they need to get to if they can't get there. You know? <laughs> 
Okay, well, I think I'm gonna let it run two more cycles and then I'm gonna probably end it. So, not this cycle, but the next one. Uh, yeah, I mean, we've been making really good progress. I'm very happy with this. Let me charge up those two batteries so quickly when these are all at 100%, so it doesn't really matter. This thing doesn't even have coal in here right now. And there it is. Get a chance to attack that bitch. Okay, Draco's are also looking good. We do have another glossy Draclet egg, which means that we're gonna get a little bit more plastic until we're done doing the whole thing and automating everything, which I am looking so forward to. We just need the second spine set up. And once the second spine set up, we're gonna let all this run. We're not gonna disconnect it. What we're gonna do is, because it's obviously once we start trying to do some other things, we're gonna need more power because of all of that power consumption. But then what we're gonna do is we're gonna tap into this bad boy. And we're gonna tap into this bad boy. Start getting a little bit more power from each spine there. That way we can start doing a little bit more things. Um, and then once that's done, then we're gonna get our second oxygen machine to make sure oxygen's not gonna be a problem, which is also gonna provide more power. So then we should have a good amount of power going. So that makes me happy. That makes me very happy. Do we care too much about rabble storage? Some of the bunker tiles. And glass forge, nice. Yeah, so we've got our lead suit stuff now. That's very nice for me. And the rad bolt sensor, that's pretty sick. I think I've seen that before. Okay, cool. Look, we've made a lot of progress in the stream. I'm gonna be honest, I mean, look, we basically strip mine this, strip mine this. We've got our refinery set up, we've got this little buffer tank thingy set up. Panicked with so many things that I lost count. <laughs> like, you're trying to look at all of our ores here and stuff, and I see if there's anything that's popping up, then I'm like, we need a rush to maybe do this now. We look like we're fine. Our igneous rock is obviously the big thing that we're trying to keep nicely done. Which we have a lot of sedimentary rock. We always switch back over to hatches, but we like using that stuff sometimes. So we'll see, we'll see. But we do have some more igneous rock here, we we'll have some more here. Don't think it's just in those piles as well. That's just sedimentary rock. This is granite. More granite. The measures like Niobe, I'm like, oh my gosh. Sedimentary. Well, we might be a little bit shit out of luck for some igneous rock, eh? <laughs> if we see that it's going like that, then we can always uh, explore, we can uh, change it back over to normal hatches to provide our coal. There's a couple of things we can do. So and our coal is pretty much just maintaining it, stayed at 108, pretty solidly. Nice, all of this stuff is done as well, pretty much. Not that it needed to be, but it's nice to just have it done, so that way it's, you know, just finished. Oh, it doesn't need to dry a wall, though. <laughs> you know it needs that dry wall. And so does this place as well, but we're not going to make them build all that drywall right now. <laughs> that took them quite a while last time. <laughs> and the atmosphere docks in as well. This, what's really nice about doing all this prep work is like at least once this is running it up and running, it should just be flowing. There shouldn't be too much problems. There should be enough power consumption, I'm hoping, from all of this. That should, because I mean, how much is each of this taking? This is taking 960 watts. Uh oh, that's a lot. Might overload this grid. I didn't realize it was going to take so much. Fucking. I knew it was probably going to take, but not that much. Oh well, it's going to increase morale. Let's increase morale, we'll do it.
Yeah, there's not going to be a lot of oxygen in here for a while, though. Shame, don't let us have nightmares again. Not nightmares, but dreams. This incubator's also going to get hot, so we should probably shield it off. Thinking about it logically. Just so that we know that we're safe like that. Okay, cool. Yeah, it looks like adding those extra meal which really helped to keep our calories alive. We will eventually get rid of these and do other stuff in these rooms probably. I don't know, maybe we will. Who, who knows? Who knows? I do want to get our colony on a better food source at some point as well. We are so running out of water. We're 20 tons of ice though. So that's nice. That'll slowly cool down and probably give us way too much water. Let's see. <laughs> Cold damage, probably. That's fine. I mean, that's okay. I'm not too bugged by that. The pipes will start moving soon. Once they get to building this stuff. Yeah, that's a wolf gas, and let's do this. Let's get this done. And you're sure you can sweep up these things at a priority six, why not? It's not that much there anyway. Yeah, get all that shit built, please, so that we are done and dusted with that. We have a bunch of Atma suits, so that should not take any time at all. Again, is very nice. Okay, I don't know how we're going to get rid of that stuff. Polluted oxygen, canisters and shit like that. I don't have a canister drop-off boat yet, and I don't really want to do that right now. Okay, I'm going to end it at cycle 165. I think that's a good idea. Um, this will then just have to happen as we play <laughs> in tomorrow and we're going to forget about it, but at least then we know that it's pumping. See, this liquid's actually also been cooled off a lot because I didn't make... Unlike last time, I didn't fuck up and I didn't make these insulated tiles. So that way all of this cold can like, you know, actually transfer a bit. Insulated tiles are up here. And this whole area can become warm. I don't really care that much. And then we can start getting data banks now as well. That's something we mustn't forget about. Let me do that. Okay. Okay, well, I'm probably going to end it then. I really just want to see them build it. No, we need to make sure it works. It's two more liquid pipes. <laughs> and then I'll end it. start pumping. It's gonna go and it's gonna release all of its contents here, which are gonna roll down. It's gonna have to get quite high up before it needs to do it. We'll then move the vent over here at that point and then that's how high our tank is gonna be. It's quite a big polluted tank. <laughs> which this deodorizer is doing a solid ass job of keeping this shit clean, I have to say. That's really nice. Surprisingly, yeah, we actually wouldn't need as much atmosphere suits we'd need them just for here right now. But we are going to carry on exploring down and up to some not so nice environments where I'd like to have those atmosphere suits ready for us. And again, moving a 12 dock atmosphere suit there is pretty shitty. Yeah, but there we go. Everything is now flowing in. And from that, it'll flow back out. And we'll keep doing that until it's heated this entire room up, which should take quite a while. Last time we were on cycle, I think, 400 and something, and it's like that. Cool. Okay, I think I'm going to save it here. Probably call it for the night. We've got a lot done, a lot of things finished. Makes me very happy. Let's just put it like this. Yuck. 
yeah, I know this makes me happy. If we can get all this stuff set up, I think we'll be in a really good good spot to finish off our main base here and then to start really getting into some power situations and then finally to start getting into some cooling because we want a huge overflow of power, like almost wastage of power. We want backups uh, or back back backlogs of the hydrogen and stuff when we start installing our thermal aqua tuners and stuff because those things are going to help out. So, yeah. I mean, right now, I don't think there's too much on our current load, potential load, current load on the heavy load wires. Not that bad. It's really not that bad. So we should be fine until we get to that 20 kilowatt range before we need to start upgrading everything. So, yeah. Okay, anyway, let me let me save an exit. Because, yeah, can't just keep saying it and not doing it. Always play more tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah, but that is a lot done. That is a lot, lot done. Okay, sweet. And it's a decent hour, decent length stream as well. Four and a half hours. That's nice and long. Tomorrow we'll try and do some other things as well. I want to catch up on all my Ari content. So I'm going to edit throughout the day. I'll probably only stream tonight, like in the night, like I did today. So yeah, then we'll have some more videos coming in on the channel as well, which I've been slacking, I know. So that will definitely start happening again. But uh, yeah. If you guys like the video, leave a like, subscribe, you know, watch this in the future, I really do appreciate it as well. Thank you guys for watching now as well, and yeah, and I'll check you guys in the next one. Cheers.